Hey gamers. <coughs> <coughs> Cut that one out. You, you want to start over? Or hey, just leave that in? No, it's just, just right. leave it Keep in. Going. <laughs> hey gay. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Yeah. Hey gamers, welcome back to Steak and Eggs podcast number 28. We are so happy to be back. We got a lot of topics to talk about. We got a lot of sponsors to talk about. Even possibly a show announcement. But guys, I'd like to welcome today's special guest, Seer. Seer, welcome to the podcast, man. Thank you very much, uh, Seer. Wait, you have to mention the Patreon. And I, also, guys, yep. big news here. Yep. Please. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> patreon.com yep. slash steak Steak and and eggs. eggs. There you go. Okay. Huge. Guys, make sure to really dig deep into that Patreon (laughs) slot.com slash steak and eggs. Fuck off. (laughs) Guys, make sure to dig deep into that Patreon.com slash steak and eggs for that exclusive content. (laughs) And then maybe if you're lucky, a couple lewds from me. (laughs) Why? Uh, well, who cares? Yeah, true. Yeah. So true. It's yeah. fine. No, why not? It's oh, fine. Oh, man. Sarah, it's a pleasure having you here, buddy. Yeah. This is great, dude. The, this couch is wonderful, man. I'm going to be real. Eating Chick-fil-A before the show really has just improved things. Right? right? It has. It's really made things a lot better. How do you feel about Chick-fil-A? You heard what they did, right? Well, about, yeah. Because like, they close they on Sunday. Huh? You know they close on Sunday? Oh, yeah. I, I know they close on Sunday. Yeah, well, what the fuck? Yeah. yeah, it is the most irritating thing on the planet when you wake up and you want a you want a chicken burrito. I'll be honest, I don't well, go to should Chick- be in church. So. I don't go to Chick Fil A out of respect. Yeah, respect to KFC. Yeah, and I've gone to KFC for thirty years, and I like Chick Fil A. It's great, but I always get KFC. Would you say it's finger looking good? Not really, but it's all right. But I always get KFC, so you just go to KFC anyway. Dude, KFC makes me feel like my heart is stopping. I want to know what the original KFC tasted like. Old man Colonel Sanders? Yeah, the actual Colonel. Yeah, I want to know what that tasted like. Yeah, what was the logo before he was an old fuck? I don't know. I I think he started it whenever he was an old fuck. He was always an old fuck. Yeah, yeah, he was born in 68 years old. He was always an old fuck. He was born in 68? No, no, Colonel Sanders, he actually led Uh, one of the fronts on, uh, uh, what is it? D-Day. The War of 19... 1916. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, guys, welcome to Steak and Eggs podcast. Is he dead? Uh, yeah, Colonel he passed Sanders, away. what do you mean? Yeah, he'd be like 150 years old by now. <laughs> 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 what are you talking about? about it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's like, the, it's like the, 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 the Taco Bell dog. So have you got... It the, is. What's the Taco Bell dog? Like Yo Quiero Taco do Bell. Do you remember that? No. Yo Quiero Taco Bell. What? Well, I don't, is this like I the Target we were dog? Like, what, we were like probably like, what, 11, yep. right? Yep. So yeah. she doesn't fucking I had the squishies, the plushies. Wait, yes. I remember. Wait, how old are you again? Let's no, not, that wasn't meant to be no, like. No, no, we don't yeah. need to hear. We don't. Yeah. All right, all right. Let's so let's talk about the Taco Bell. I'm just dog, asking. Okay? It's the League of Legends in you. Yeah. yeah. So there used to be a dog that Taco Bell had, and he had a ring around his eye. And is this not the Target dog? I feel like I'm going nope, insane. That's Wait, that's Target dog that's, ring. The ring around his eye is Spot. Was yeah. It, was it? Yeah, yeah. The white dog with the red eye. That's that's now that's the, spot. Chihuahua. the Chihuahua. The Chihuahua. It was the Chihuahua. Yeah. And he it didn't have the ring. Nope. Around? No? Yeah, can we get a uh, Google dude. on the old Yo yeah. Quiero Taco so Bell this racist dog? like a, a 90s <laughs> advertisement. Yeah, no, I'm serious. No, he knows. He yeah. knows. The dog oh, is 90s. racist as a So fuck. the dog oh, was absolutely. racist. He was racist? Yeah. Yes. Oh, so no. the dog would basically show up in the commercials. And uh, there he is. Yeah. Okay, so right he didn't there. have the, yeah. That oh, was the dog. Oh, yeah, I was thinking so of the Target one. We all had plushies of this. And you could get the yeah. plushies and you could squeeze it. You could squeeze his foot. Why does the dog look like an orc from World of Warcraft? Am I wrong? But he'd, really. go, he'd go like this. He'd go, Yo quiero Taco Bell. Yeah. Um, what does that mean? I want Taco Bell. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm and he would idea. say other lines as well. Uh, but they got rid of him. They killed him. I, yeah, I yep. think they killed yeah, him. Yeah, they actually killed, took him out back and shot him with a shotgun. Yeah, and they probably. commercialized that. Then they ground him up and put him into a Crunchwrap Supreme. Yep, and yep. it was called the Yo Quiero Special. Oh my God, it was so good. <laughs> and then they took it off the menu. In Just the 90s like was crazy. Yeah, because you remember the people we used to say that Taco Bell was great F meat, which is the same as dog food, is because it was made of dogs. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, I think that, yeah, probably the uh, the little mascot didn't help that. Wait, dude, do you remember the machines where you would take the coin and you would put it in and then you'd like spin it to get the special prizes at Taco Bell? Oh! <gasps> 
Do you remember that? Yes. Oh my yes. God. McDonald's had one really? with water. Yep. 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 Oh, yep. We had one yep. of those with Long John Silvers, but it was like it like the coins would go down, and then it would have like a, a thing that would move them forward. Yes. And yes. then you would try to get the they coins. They still have back. those at the uh, I have no fucking machines. clue what you guys are talking about. Yes, you do. You have, so, so yep. whenever we had your announcement. Those things. Those things. Yep. Yes. And I was really good at it. So so Emmy, I know oh, you're looking at that. Yeah, that? yeah, you're looking at that, and I yes. know that you're concerned. So listen, so basically yep. the goal was. If you landed it on the yellow, you'd you get, get a special like a free prize. taco or some shit, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, was, wait, no, I have, the I have seen these. The no, I, I do remember Which is these. Like half the things on the menu at that point. Yeah, yeah. 100%. But yeah. so basically they would collect those coins and it would go to help a local team graduate. Oh, mm -hmm. wow. I don't believe that. No. Did you think they I thought, did? I thought they just pocketed them. Yeah, yeah sure I had no idea. Uh, I mean, they just- Yeah, have you ever met someone that's like, I am the Taco Bell team graduate? Probably well, based not. on current uh, state of this nation and our education in this country, they probably didn't go to them. Because so, I'm just yeah. saying, like, when have you ever been approached in your whole life and, thought, and heard, hey, this is from Taco Bell. This is going to get you through high school, buddy. I never heard that a single time in my whole life. I don't believe it. Yeah. It's almost for college. Maybe they're right? just stealing all the money. I think they're uh, pocketing it. Yeah. I, I bet you Mr. Beast has done more for people than Taco Bell has done for And that's why people hate him. <laughs> like, yeah. I didn't believe, because like, you know, whenever you grow up and you hear like, you know, everybody hated Jesus, right? I was everybody just going to say Jesus. Hate, oh, Jesus. Oh, bro, this guy is ruining everything. And then Mr. Beast cures people from blindness and they say, yo, what the fuck what? are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Do you really? yeah. Okay, let's break it down yeah. a little bit. Yeah. Okay. okay, what yeah, did yeah. Jesus do besides wash a couple feet? Right. Uh, Turn a, bun a little bit of water into wine. Yeah, he did that. Heal a, what, six or seven blind people and yeah. then die? No, oh, he, there's he, one. He, he turned a bunch of fish into like a thousand fish. Well, there was one people. guy that did was that? dead. Yeah, he did and, that. Yeah, and, duping it got patched. Yeah, like the, he turned like some bread and yeah. fish and he fed like a thousand people yeah, or something. Did. It was yeah, like two fish and then. like three loaves or some shit. Absolute min maxer. <laughs> what the hell? I didn't yeah, that. He's that dupe that that glitch. Well, you can like walk on water and shit. Yeah. He did he walk did, on water a couple times. I yeah, personally did. haven't seen proof. Yeah. I would like to see proof. Well, they didn't have cameras then. That's whenever a lot of the miracles happened. Yeah. Nobody clipped it? No, no. But uh, probably not. I, I think it is safe to say that Mr. Beast is more of a, has done more than, than Christ himself. I mean, it's getting there. I mean, it really <laughs> is. Like, I, I, I cannot wait for him to do another video like that. Because farming the amount of people that get mad about it is fucking amazing. I love it. Did you see his new video? Which one? He got one person of every country to fight in a battle royale. Like fist fight? No, they all competed in squid games. That's so cool. I feel Wait, like did they that. Die? Uh, no, it was dope. What percentage of the comments were racist? Oh, all of them. Yeah. And then Dick <laughs> Zerto was just like, Mr. Beast included this one. He didn't include this one. He did this and this. And I was like, all right. That wasn't Mr. Beast. That was not Dexterdo. That was Austin Ox, Hassan's editor, pretending to oh, be Dexterdo. Oh, Dexterdo Nox? Yes. Yeah, oh, that, was it that's, really? That's not a real news source. That's just some guy on Twitter. Well, Dexterdo I mean, to be Nox. fair. Nobody, I mean, on, nobody on that website is a true, true news I swear to God, Dick Zerto, I have no idea who the fuck that other guy for, is. For instance, yeah. I get my news from Fox News. So that's right. an actual valid didn't, news source. Yeah, true. I'm, so, I'm so sorry if this is wrong, but didn't Kick say that Dexterto Knox or Austin Knox like basically like fucked up a bunch of their contracts by tweeting out fake contracts? I, I know nothing know. of that. I, I feel like- No, I'm you're sure. talking about Trainwreck said that. Oh, well, and he we'll said kick. something like that, but I don't know if it was, yeah, kick. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure if that probably, I think it's because people say that they get like, I don't think that kick is paying people out like $75 million, $50 million. Wait, you didn't get that contract? I, did. I, I don't know. I mean, like maybe they get the that. Contract. I got the contract. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. 75 million. So everybody else got it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. I see how it is. All right. Yeah. Well, fuck you, Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. And now... A word from our sponsors. Hi, I'm Emru, streamer and basketball athlete, just like you. <laughs> Have you heard of the number one finance app on the US App Store, Cash App? Cash App is a simple, safe, and easy to use app to help you stay in control with your finances. It's got awesome tools for sending, spending, and setting easy to track saving goals. Now watch this. Thanks to Cash App, I've upped my game and stayed ahead of my money management. Now, I'm more confident than ever. Hey, Jay, pass. Great catch, teammate. Jay was just telling me how Cash App has no hidden fees and a free to order debit card. Right after we won the big game, he also told me that there's card block, face ID, and real-time transaction alerts. 
Thanks, Jay. You can download Cash App for free on the App Store or Google Play. The link is in the description below. Thanks, Cash App. Did you know Antarctica is hollow? Well, that's Whoa. because the Nazis what? are in, uh, are underneath it. Finally, a man who speaks the truth. Yeah, exactly. Well, <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Everyone's you don't know just about just that lying shit? And shit. No, this is never, crazy. So you oh, don't yeah. do your own research. Wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You have to fuck? do. Your, you have to go on websites that don't have uh, a web designer, and yeah. then those are the websites that will tell you where Hitler is yeah. right now. Oh my God. And right underneath that, it'll tell you where Bigfoot is too. Yes, that is true. Yep. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> yeah. oh, oh, oh. I know I know where Bigfoot is. Yeah. He's he's probably streaming uh NFL Madden right now. <laughs> hey? <laughs> good yeah, ones here. Yeah. Real good <laughs> ones. Probably accurate. So let's move yeah. on to the topic at hand. Okay. Global infrastructure, yeah. gun reform. What right. do you think? I think it it. Uh, I think it has its highs and lows. I think it has its pros and cons. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, like, if every kid had a gun at school, wouldn't that just be better? Hey, bro, that would be fucking <laughs> yeah. crazy. What could go Everything wrong? Everything is just battle royale. Well, I mean, I didn't say they'd have bullets. Mm. Oh, yeah, but come on. Then what's just the point? Visualize well, that. Like, it's, it's about learning. What? Learning what? Well, it's like, you know, whenever you give a kid a little car, right? It's not an actual car. It's like a fake car. Hear me out. So what are you teaching them? How to crash. He you? Yeah. But, 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 so what are you teaching them with the, the empty guns? I almost got in a, on a wreck to, uh, <laughs> go driving over here. Yeah. Again? Yeah. Again, yeah. What happened? Well, do I wasn't paying work? attention. <laughs> Were you texting and driving? Actually, this is going to sound crazy. Yep. No, I wasn't. Oh, okay. Go yeah, on. I wasn't. It was really kind of weird. I, yeah, can't even, usually, I can't even imagine that. Because I avoid like seven car accidents really? a day. Plus the, the traffic here was so bad. Wait, you're avoiding seven the a traffic day? Traffic here is yeah, gross. I, oh yeah, bro. It's bad. The place where I live, it's Ooh. bad, bro. I don't know. You, Older you, kids have guns. You do yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do know that people that are frequently, you know, avoiding accidents, usually they are the problem. No, yeah, yeah, I don't think like so. usually most people. No, that doesn't make any sense. You're one of those main character like drivers. The common denominator. I think yeah. I think I'm just unlucky. Yeah, that's what I think it is. Right. Okay. Yeah, I just don't know, man. Like, uh, I drive on the right side of the lane. Dude, like, last else. time he talked about this, he said he took his hands off the wheel and almost ran into his no, neighbor. Let Jesus take, take the, the wheel. wheel. So, yeah. I'm gonna say this. So, a good thing is, you know, when you get tired, you get a yeah. little sleepy at the wheel. I'm just saying, if just you close just close your eyes, close relax. your eyes, say a little prayer, and just let it. Just yeah. no, let dude, the drowsiness take no, over. This <laughs> is what you do because I, I do this a lot. Okay, uh -oh. you half sleep. Which means you drive and then you close one of your eyes so you can sleep on the left side. Yeah. And then you swap to the other side and then you sleep on the other side. And well, then you can take a nap. So like it's like right brain and like left brain yep. thinking, but like it's it's like right brain yep. and left brain sleeping. And then it works. And then okay. when you go on a long straight road, that's when you can close your eyes and then you count to 10 and then you reopen. Well, you could be like yep. Daredevil, right? And you close your eyes and it enhances your other senses. <laughs> yeah. So you can smell if you're about to get in a yeah, wreck. I can feel the wreck. <laughs> and like, you know, if you're going over like one of the lines, you can like feel it in the car because yeah. you have your eyes closed. Oh, God. Dude, there's a joke I want to say, but it's such a bad idea. <laughs> All I'm saying is... Does it involve 9-11? Why is drunk driving illegal if it's so damn fun? <laughs> I have, I, I'll be honest. I've never, ever, yeah. ever like drunk driven or anything like that because yeah. I don't like to drink. I straight up don't, and I've had to drive a lot of people home, and we have almost gotten pulled over, and I've been so scared so many times. Have you guys Wait. ever been pulled over before? Like, yes. Yeah, I've been actually, pulled over. Yes. You guys Multiple times, happen. actually. I yeah. literally RP my way out. Really? You can RP your way out. I just tell the cop, I'm like, he's like, why did you pull me over? I'm like, could be three or four things. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And he's like, okay, well, it's like usually if you're, I feel like if you're honest with them and you don't like tell them that like, it, it's like, I don't know, you're going to like, you don't ask them for their badge number. You're not obnoxious. Like it, it'll be fine. Well, I, then, I agree. This is what yeah. I'm going to do. I think next time I get pulled over, when yeah. it comes down, they roll up, serve. Do you have any idea how fast you're going? Blah, blah. I'm going to yeah. say, first off, relax. Second off, with the connections that I have in North Korea and Russia, you need to really reconsider what you're about to say. Mm -hmm. I'm a very dangerous man. I will wipe you and your family off the face of this planet. The United Nations, they're going to make sure nobody knows about it. And then my association with terrorist nations, 
I'm going to wipe out this planet. And then, and then didn't it, tell him that he's being recorded right now. Yeah, being recorded right now. <laughs> being recorded right now. Yeah. It's being brought. And then you drive off as fast as possible. <laughs> yeah. Reverse as fast as you can into the car, then accelerate as fast as you can. And you get away every time. <laughs> At least for a few minutes. Yeah. So don't do that. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, my dad, he like taught me the, the trick on how to get out of a speeding ticket because he was a, he's Purple Heart military. Yeah. So he'd get pulled over and he'd be like, every time, no matter what, every single time he got pulled over, it's because he just got back from Iraq. Uh -huh. <laughs> he said the same, he's like, he's like, well, officer, I just got back from Iraq. And I Thank just, you for your service. Yeah, and it's, I just, I'm just trying to see my kids. I forgot how fast I was going. Flash is his little, yeah. flash his little ID card with Purple Heart on it, bro. It's so funny. Did you, did you love your father? <laughs> yeah. I yeah, love, I love yeah, your mother. Then, yeah. Wait, what? I love your mother. Do you? Yeah. She's a whore, man. Is that right? I, I yeah. know. I Damn. Know. After the things Damn. that Sears done to her? Oh, wow. Because the is thing it that is, bad, huh? it's, it's really that bad. Yeah. Can you imagine if every single kid who told you on Xbox that he fucked your mom that it was the truth? I I'm sure it has been true. Every I never moment. got that. Like, am I crazy? I never I've got I've never gotten that either. Yeah. You like never got that? Game. You never no. got that? I fucked your mom. I've never gotten an, an unironic mom. Joke. Yeah, like, I, I don't really a serious mom threat. Exactly. Like I have fucked your mom. I've had sex. With <laughs> yeah, I've never <laughs> so had somebody crazy. say that to me. I, I feel like that. that's like that's way overblown. Usually, it's just people that are screaming slurs at you. Yeah, that's that is a really realistic is. gaming experience. Yeah, exactly. Like that's the that's the actual like Halo Two, mm -hmm. Call of Duty. I feel like anytime, even now, if somebody gives me like a microphone and I'm on like Xbox Live. I have to scream into the microphone. Okay, I really thought you were about to say something. <laughs> I don't go that I really way. thought you were yeah, I, don't, I have to say it. No. <laughs> no, I, 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 I don't know. I Whenever feel like scream is off and it's just closed doors and yeah. nobody knows and I'm on my alt. Yeah. I have to say it. <laughs> <laughs> I have to say it. You got to keep up with tradition. Oh, <laughs> no, dude. Yeah, I love Golden Corral. I never did that. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> nice throwback. You know, I, I hate how people say that, like, gaming has changed because I've queued into, like, Warzone matches recently. Nothing's changed. Wait, what, what, what do they say has changed? Well, like, people the community? don't say what they used to say. Oh. All they do. Oh, mm -hmm. they do. They it's do. the exact oh, same as it used to be. One million I don't. I don't realize really I've played League for long than like twenty four hours yeah. of being told to kill myself, and then oh, I yeah. must like at least five slurs. So, like, uh, surely back to Golden Corral. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be honest. I've never been. What? Yeah, that's the buffet <laughs> place, right? Yes, like I the really it. dirty buffet place. Yes, yes, yeah. I, I go to. I go to. It's the best. Oh my god! Well, it's, it's the best one, and they have like the chocolate fountain. Yeah, and it's that. like I yeah. feel like after that the. Is, that's so that's gross. That's got to be disgusting. Well, because everybody, well, no. I mean, yeah, but I mean, yeah. Here's the thing. When you're a kid and you're not looking at the subtleties and, and the cracks in the wall and the, the flies on the mac and cheese and the snot that's in the chocolate fountain and, you know, some of the old racist people that are there, you're just like enjoying, they have everything there at me. Yeah. Mac and cheese, crab legs, egg rolls, spaghetti. Spaghetti. Tacos. Uh, tacos. Steak. Steak. Do buffets hamburger, still exist post COVID? They do. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. There's a like a, there's like one on I thirty five. There's a golden you, corral. On I that's got to be fucking gross. There's no way you get there without like. Well, you got to put a face diaper on because good old Biden has. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I had a guy. I went to Chipotle and I walked up behind this dude and he's. This is like during COVID. He pulls the mask down. He's like, I'm really pretty sick of wearing these, you know. And I'm like, <laughs> I remember this. for sure, man. <laughs> And I, then, like, I, I, I pause. He comes back. He's like, you know, they did kill JFK. Yeah. And I was like, oh, fuck. And it was a long line. I got to learn a lot that day. Learned a lot from that guy. I need one of those experiences, man. I yeah. miss the out-of-pocket shit old people, the shit that old people would say, man. Yeah. Fuck. What do you think? What do you think made them like that? Like, why are old people so fucked up? Well... You know, a lot of it is conditioning of the world that they grow in, grew in. Mm -hmm. A lot of it could be is when you get older, you end up surround in a world surrounded with diversity. That, diversity. Yeah. And more and more often as you get older, it's more things you don't understand. Mm -hmm. And as you get older, you care less to learn about those things. So you get you start resenting society and you're like society change. It's you you want to point your finger at something or someone or a group of people because you want to blame changes on something when in reality you're the one that just got old and outdated. When That's does that when does that true. kick in? What age? I'm turning 30 this year. Uh well, I mean like, okay, so I think it kind of already has kicked in. 
Like, I mean, there's obviously there are things that like kids say now that you probably think are stupid. Yeah, what pisses you off yeah. about like new it's age like, culture? It, like, you know, for example, like the rappers that like their outfit is the same color as like a Skittles. Yeah, I think know, that's for, it cool, bro. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I like, saw your but, Gucci gang cover. I did see that. That, that was, was that cool. hilarious. I don't Incredible. know how. Yeah. Somebody messaged me. They thought that shit was real. That's you know? crazy. Like, yeah, I was like, there's no way. There's that was no way. so funny. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't know. I feel like there's always going to be like those things that like kids do. And it's like every time that there's a new thing, like I've started saying the on God and like for mm -hmm. real, for real, like no I've, done it, for real? I've, I've done it unironically <laughs> or sorry, I've done it ironically for so long. Now I do it unironically. Oh, same. I did the same yeah. swag. Yep. Swag annoyed the shit I out of me. I never used that one. I didn't really use it. Actually, about, I did a little bit. What about lit? Lit? Oh yeah, I use that. That shit lit. Yeah. yeah. I say lit. What are, the, what are the kids saying these days? There's swag, lit, bussin'? Um, bussin'? Yeah, bussin'. There's a bunch of them. I mean, what's the, what are the youth saying? You're the youngest here. You should know. Yeah. I don't know, like W. That's it? Oh, yeah, W. Oh, that's <laughs> right. Wait, no, I told you guys about the one that I saw a bunch of people were doing uh, uh. where they're like, chat, is this real? Oh, it's just yeah. like oh, some like random yeah. fucking thing that has nothing to do with streaming. I love that, bro. That is so funny. <laughs> It'll just be like a video of someone like acting really fucking dumb and the comments will be like, chat, is this real? <laughs> yeah. I feel like because they use the word chat and it's usually all caps, I feel like they got that from Kai. Mm. Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah, yeah, I think it's definitely I think it's Kai or Speed, yeah. Mm -hmm. There's the, uh, that shit's busting. Did you see his dick? Who's? Speed's? No, I, I didn't, see it. I, I didn't, I didn't. see it. Oh, did y'all hear? Did you hear about this? I heard about it. I that did not see it. That was fucking funny. I do not know. Yeah. I've heard about it. I have not seen it. I'm not gonna go watch a dude flop his dick out. Like it's it's something. Like I mean, I I I, you I heard know. I heard that he's hooded. That's about the only thing I heard. I don't know. I have no okay. fucking idea. Like I, I made a video about it, but I didn't watch the actual clip. It's you didn't check the source. Fuck no, that's nasty. Hey, can we pull that up? But uh, how do yeah. you? Know, but, how, but what is the? What if everybody didn't check it? Like, what if his dick actually didn't come out? So it's like it, it's like a Mandela effect. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> no, I'm pretty sure his dick fell out. I'm pretty yeah. sure. <laughs> yeah, remember whenever this happened? No, it didn't happen. Yo, somebody pull up the clip. <laughs> don't, don't do don't that. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to fucking see that shit. No, I feel like uh, I feel like all of those things actually really help people a lot. You know, like oh, yeah. he'll be better off because of this. One million percent. It's the same as Kai. You know, starting that riot that's going to help him. Mm -hmm. That's going to be I, that's going to be good for his career. I still reference that too today. Yeah, you know, I play Hollow Cure, and I feel like you could start a riot. Yeah, I do. Anytime I talk at an OTK event, I get at least oh, five yeah, riots. I see that. <laughs> yeah. If I say one damn thing, man, one damn thing. I like the uh, I, I like that kind of stuff. I wish that there were more streams that were more unhinged. Like whenever I see somebody that's like completely going off the rails, I know that it's actually going to be exciting to watch because I won't know what to predict. That's some old school Twitch stuff. Yeah, just like some wild, really really crazy. Yeah, or kick stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Oh yeah, kick is wild. Well, just mm -hmm. wait till Amish week. What? What? Get this. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah. Hear me out. Yeah. All right. Techie and I, yeah. living in a Orthodox Amish, I'm not sure if that's how you say it, house, right? And we're just, okay. it's live streamed, wired up, whatever. And we're being trained by Amish folk. To do we what? Yeah, we have to live like that to, like, for a make week. make butter? Yeah, yeah. Just, you know, take care of cows. You know, you always got to work. Woodworking, yeah. saddle making, get yeah. out there, feed pigs, feed cows. It's all documented. But we can't read chat during that entire week. The only way we can read is by donations that get sent to us in the form of letter. Yep. Like that we have to open up and we read the letters and like, okay. dear Tectone and Seer, yep. I've been loving your, you know, blah, 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 You know what's crazy? If we were to charge 50 bucks a pop for those TTS, yep. huge. Oh, it'd be great. And we, then we, we recoup the, the funds on day one. We do that yeah. for a week. We're millionaires. Yeah, it's like Big Brother, but Amish. Well, we're already Amish. millionaires. Billionaires. Yeah. Well, I, I mean, it's a great idea. That's great, right? I don't think this that doesn't the, sound super Amish for some reason. <laughs> Why? Why? Well, I don't think these, do the Amish use the postal system. I thought yeah, they, yeah, they, they do. do. They just don't use technology, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's I different don't. types of Amish as well. That some yeah. that do use technology. Yeah, yeah. They use certain kinds of technology, mm -hmm. but not like the good kinds. So like they'll use like electricity, but not like a smartphone or some kind of yeah. shit. I feel like if you're using a smartphone and you're Amish, it's kind of like there. There is a community. Yeah that do, do use cell phones, but they have sort of a kind of like in the essence of North Korea, their own like little- Oh. Like, 
like web blocker system. Oh yes, did you see that video? Yes. I saw Are you the talking same about the video. same guy as the me? The bald guy? Yeah, I've been I watching his stuff it. recently. He goes yes. to the Appalachian Hills. Yes, I watched I that. haven't seen this. The, these videos are great to watch. So like he goes and he interviews and he talks to people from like these crazy different cultures and mm -hmm. stuff. And like I watched the Amish one. And so that's how like I yep. know like a lot of the same stuff. Amish people are pretty cool. Yeah. Do they I was surprised. Do they produce a lot of carbon emissions or no? Well, how no. the fuck are they going to make carbon? I, I heard like cow farts are like the top source of Yeah, but I mean, if we want to get know. into- That's if like we cow get, factories and shit. Yeah, right. but, I cow mean, factories. How many cows problem. though? I had, a, I, had a, I had a dream that yeah. uh, the carbon like finally destroyed the ozone. Uh-huh. And it like, like it like broke. It's, not, then, it's not a dream, Techie. It's, it's happening. Yeah. But like, think about it this way. The ozone finally snaps. Uh -huh. It like shatters in the it sky. Snaps. Yeah. <laughs> like some Final Fantasy cutscene. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And you see the stars and it's all black. It's like a big black hole in the ozone. And then over the intercoms, it says, because the ozone has evaporated, all oxygen will be depleted from Earth in 24 hours. That'd be wild. Spend time with your loved ones. Okay. And then you can just feel the, the air being sucked out of the Earth. You'd be on Honkai. Okay. I would be doing You'd my be like dailies. this. You'd be like, yeah. Imagine what your Animal Crossing villagers are doing after everybody's died on Earth. Tom Nook is still out there taking their money. Oh no! I well, there'd be Tom so Nook. many fucking yeah. weeds. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> be so many, bro. Fuck. I never played any Animal Crossing past the first one. Like, well, I, I felt like it was kind of pointless because you just do the same thing. Well, Tom Nook is your typical landlord asshole. Yeah. Who's is like, he? hey, hey. We're going to talk about rent, rent, huh? Yep. It's, yeah. gone <laughs> it's gone up. <laughs> hey, would you like an upgrade? You want to upgrade your place? Yeah. Okay, sure. Take it the upgrade. more money. By the way, it's going to be 100,000 bells. 100 million <laughs> dollars. I'm <Yeah>. so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, he actually doesn't tell you how much it's going to cost. I He's would kill upgrade. Tom Nook. Really? Yep. Just take him out? Old school with a, a um, what do they call him? A blackjack. Old school blackjack style. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, like, he's like walking back in his, unlo he's like unlocking his shop to go in. Yeah. Boom. Tom Nook wakes up in the back corner. <laughs> uh -huh. The music's like, dum, 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 dum. Woo, do, do. you got Sloopy in there in the guitar. He's like, you yeah. fucked up that car, Tom Nook. <laughs> fucked up for the last time. You fucked up my life, Tom Nook, and I want it back. <laughs> Fuck this that. is making me want to play Animal Crossing again. It's a good game. The problem yeah. is you say that and you'll never play. Yeah, it. like any of my recommendations. The PvP sucks. Really? Yeah. The that PvP. sucks. Yeah. I feel like if they added guns to Animal Crossing, I feel like I'd be more likely to play it. They're adding guns to Pokemon. What? No, they're are, not. You, are they really doing that? Yes, they are. Like a gun? Like like are you talking Pokemon? about like a paintball gun? A no, gun? It's, like, no, like a it's like the Pokemon are being enslaved. Yep. And so okay. they're armed up. And now the Pokemon is FPS. There is a gun Pokemon game coming out. Yep, Pal, Pal World. Pal World. Yep. I thought it was a joke. I it's thought real. I thought he was. Oh, Pal. But are they actually guns or it's just an FPS? Yes, game? they're it's, actually no, guns. They're actually guns. It's Pal World. It's Pokemon with guns. It's hilarious. I. It's exactly oh how you're imagining it. Yeah. It is fucking hilarious. So, the, like, you play as a Pokemon that like rises. You play up. as a trainer who's freeing the slave oh. Pokemons. And then you collect the Pokemon and each Pokemon has its own gun. And they're actually cute. That like, it's like cool, it, actually. Yeah, it's like a Jigglypuff with like an assault rifle. That's cool. <laughs> That's Wait, so the, the Pokemon have guns themselves? Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, I thought you shot the Pokemon <laughs> with the guns. You do, you do that as well. It's, it's like a different version of Pokemon Snap. Yeah. So yep. look, look at this shit. What okay, all right. I want to see. Look how cute they I, are. I don't believe. Like, where's that have look a gun? Look at the guns. Wait, this actually looks really good. Yeah, this Doesn't looks it? cool. So, so. Okay, not bad. Yep. Okay, can you shoot that one? What happens if you shoot the slaves? Well, you see the slaves? That's wild. Yeah, yeah, those are the slaves. Look at that. This, and this they're making guns. Wild. They're making oh, guns. Wait, they're this, in a conveyor belt. This isn't belt. an actual Pokemon game, is no, it? No, this is an Apple factory, actually. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Like this, this isn't Nintendo, right? Uh, I don't know. I, uh, I'm not I'm not sure, but that, this that's is a awesome. fucking Pokemon, bro. Yeah. That is the best that Lugia. But it's, it's not... That's Latias right there. It's not there. literally yeah. Pokemon, is well, it? Well, no, it's not literally Pokemon, but, but like, let's be to, honest, it's fucking Pokemon. It's Pokemon. It's supposed to be. Oh, well, I, think I, when we, I thought this was like an official franchise it, thing, like, and I was like, what the game freak? This is crazy. It's, it's, like, it's, it's, like, it's like Digimon's no, is not cool. Pokemon, but Digimon is yeah, Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. No, I, yeah, I get it now. This is cool, though. Like, Agumon is Charizard. We I mean, all know. Did it. Pokemon sort of. Um, are they the first to say, like, to do the, like, capturing monster thing? Like, monster capture and, like, well, I think, that was like, I think zoos that. did that. Yeah, yeah that's true. Yeah. 
That's true. But like, yeah, besides that, I think, yeah, Pokemon was like the first one. Hey, can I talk about something? Probably yeah. can not. Can we discuss but go ahead. Pokemon meat? Because I've yeah. been thinking about this. this In the Pokemon is this world, like, they- Is this like Tinder? <laughs> yeah, what is this? No, because in po Pokemon, no, no, because in the Pokemon universe, they're yeah. eating meat, right? And some Toros, of them, yeah. some of they they hunt Pokemon and they eat meat. So let's discuss which Pokemon would have the best meat. Like Mr. Mime, for instance, okay. does he have the same rights as another Pokemon? So you could eat a oh, Taurus. He's more more of a humanoid. Yes, you yeah. could eat a Taurus. But what happens if you want to eat? A Mr. Mime. Oh, do they canonically eat Pokemon in the Pokemon universe? Uh, I do. There believe, were poachers that that hunt them and I eat them. I do believe they do. I could right, be wrong, right. but I believe you. They eat Tauros. So why stop I mean, at Tauros? That make, kind of makes sense, you know. Why yeah. stop at Tauros? Well, I mean, like you don't want to go and eat like a like a one bug. of the grass Pokemon. Yeah, That's like nasty. Oh uh, no, I think Chikorita would taste really good. You think so? Yeah, I've seen a video of her being dissected and consumed. Honestly, oh, wow. I think Mew. Put Mew? that bad boy down on a plate, like veal. Yes, yeah. exactly. Mew would be like a veal, okay, and I people like would that. be like, "Stop what? eating Mews." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, God. So delicious. Mewtwo would be a bit more gaming. Okay, here yeah, we go. Yeah, for sure. Here we go. While that may be, seem a bit violent and weird, some people out, or weird some people out, it's been established in the franchise for a long time that humans consume Pokemon. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yep. I want to elaborate on that. Did, did they get any oh, powers man. from it? Like, did they, can they like shoot fire for like a half hour if you eat a Charizard? I mean, I don't know, but like, I mean, if you look up a Pokemon called Appleton, like, yo, Jay, can we pull up Appleton? Oh, you showed us. That's the apple like, pie. Yeah, bro, bro was an apple pie. Like, what yeah, is I, that? I, I, I eat that. I'm going to be honest. I eat that bitch. <laughs> yeah, mean, yeah, okay. If you're, if you're evolution- Right. In, would, in, he, in, would he be meat or apple pie? Yeah, that's what I mean. So yeah. what, imagine evolving as an apple pie meant to be eaten. Yeah, like, would he be an animal? Look or at that fucking is there like, uh, How do you evolve as that? And so on that same topic, <laughs> Emmy, yes. Emmy, on that same topic, if I cut into an Oddish- Yep. Do I get vegetable or do I get blood? You, I think you that blood. you get vegetable. Because like in my mind, I think the Pokemon are like a, they're like uh, manifestations of like that type of thing. You know, okay. like a-, a That matter. A, yeah, a real manifestation of it. Yeah, it's like you have like 50 radishes and then one of them is an oddish. So, all like right. Like a mutation. So- Okay, this kind of blows my mind yeah. a little bit. So the Pokemon, they react. They're pretty coherent. So they're well, not. Are, they only say one. They only say their name, right? Unless you're Mewtwo, then they talk. That's that was just for the movie. Let's be real. Yeah, that's true. Like nobody gave a fuck about that. That was so weird. <laughs> yeah, but Meowth also talked. So oh, let's say. Oh, that was stupid. He doesn't yeah. count. He's different, right? He's yeah, but Meowth wasn't that different. He just trained himself to speak English, which yeah. means other Meowths can do it. Well, he was also so, in Team Rocket. Yes. Which is like they didn't follow the rules anyway. Yes. Which means there is somewhere, somewhere where they are eating meows that can speak English and they're like, No! <laughs> no, I, th I think it's like if this, yes. the Pokemon is based off something that you would eat, like say like, <laughs> I don't know, like a, a meat animal, but like you wouldn't eat a cat. I would eat a Pikachu. That's some. That's like a rat, right? You wouldn't eat a rat. Yeah, but you see how fat that is? How you much wouldn't meat? Yeah, a little it's car. a fat rat. <laughs> 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 you wouldn't eat a rat. Well, I don't know. I mean, it depends. Like, if people told me that, like, the rats were really good, I'd probably eat them. When I was a kid, I used to dream of having a ditto as my girlfriend. Why? Because it could be anything I wanted it to be. Yeah, be but it still has the ditto face. I know. So you'd have to deal with that. Yeah, you really? bag it. <laughs> have you ever seen <laughs> ditto, have you seen <laughs> ditto <laughs> turn into a girl? No, I haven't seen ditto that. Ditto has turned into humans, but it just its face is just two dots in a, st oh <laughs> a my straight God. line. See, that's hot, bro. <laughs> so, like, really, really low-budget anime. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. I mean, that and Gardevoir as well. What if it goes like this, though? Let's dig a little deeper into that. Okay. What yeah. if it goes like, you know, let's say you get a little intimate. Yeah. And it just goes, Dado! Dado! And well, you got to get the, yeah, you probably got to tape that up, too. <laughs> that would, like, really mess things up. <laughs> what what would you be down if it was like, Dado! Yeah! Oh, God. I was a fucking loser. So brother. what other Pokemon even? did you want as a girlfriend? I would, I would <laughs> fuck Gardevoir. I would fuck Ditto. Uh-huh. Uh, Hitmonchan? No. That's, um, yeah. Who's another? F oh, yeah. Uh, uh, the bun the Buneary. The big one. The big one. What about... Uh, uh, Vaporeon? Yeah, Vaporeon. Absolutely. Because wow. they have acid armor, which is special defense, which means it's even more resistant to take a pounding. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah, you've seen... No, no. It's it's oh a my whole God. thing. <laughs> yep. Uh, um, what, would, you give, would you give Mr. Mime a go? Yeah. 
<laughs> Absolutely. Can you imagine? Mr. Mind. Dude, imagine the shit that he could make you feel with his psychic powers. Oh my God. Right? Mm. He could make you trip like crazy. Imagine him using fucking confusion to jerk you off. Psychic powers. <laughs> A long distance hand job. That shit would be nuts. And that is thinking about it, which is the worst. Yeah, yeah. Wild, man. That is absolutely unacceptable. I feel like. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Bro, is you can't. (laughs) Oh, man. He's afraid. I feel like Nintendo's going to send us a DMCA. And the crazy thing, you know, Mr. Mime was fucking Ash's mom the whole series, dude. You think so? Yeah, dad was never there. All she has is her Mr. Mime. Wonder why. He's like this. Yeah. Mime! <laughs> Mime! <laughs> oh, God, that's so bad. Mm. I remember, I never even really watched Pokemon when I, I was just a kid. Think that like, there's a lot more questions that need to be asked about yeah. the universe that are never talked about. You think so? Like yes. what? Um, okay. Pokemon are ancient, right? Uh, okay. So. If they so does this mean like this the fucking Pokemon spends like ten thousand years just to get eaten? Yeah. Well, let's let's Sucks. let's. But, just, but additionally, yes. Okay. Yep. Mister Mime. Mister okay. is a very common and modern English terminology, right? Yeah. How was Mister Mime, Mister Mime, in the ancient times before human culture really existed? Well, That's true. maybe because his name originally was Mime, because he doesn't say Mister Mime; he just says Mime. Right? But Mime to Mime is also a human concept. Well, at that point, it could have been, the human concept could have been derived from him if he was that ancient. That's right? true. And then the mister could have been applied to him later on because he's more humanoid. You know what I just You see, of? I think that that's what would make more sense. Imagine this shit, okay? I'm about to blow your mind. Okay. What what was Jesse's Pokemon in Team Rocket? Uh, the Kumos? snake. Yep. yep. And then what was James's? <laughs> uh, 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 coughing. coughing. And later he got a... Weezing? A Victor Bell. Oh, no, yeah. Bell. What do you think they were doing with those things? Think about that. No. You ever think about that? Yo, no. pull that shit up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. Okay? No. Dude, J- J- Jesse had a fucking snake for obvious reasons. And then, dude, James literally had a weeping bell that he used as a fucking flashlight. What? Oh my yeah. God. You sh- are you sure about yes, that? I'm Wild. absolutely sure about that. I don't know about that, that cannot man. Be, it cannot be a coincidence. I feel like that's a lot. <laughs> I mean, the the farthest I'll go is that like you, which which is the hmm. the snake that's like spells cobra backwards or Ekans, arbok? Ekans, 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 and yeah. Right, and then they have muck, which is come Com. back. Yeah, yeah, and then they're using a phallic shaped Pokemon and. Yeah, that's, Pokemon. that's about as far as I think it was intended. Maybe maybe even that wasn't intended. What is the most innuendo Pokemon that exists? Because it probably does, right? I don't know. The more like, ooh, we squeezed it in. <laughs> yeah. Like that type. I feel like Vaporeon is that, but that's only because of the internet. Mewtwo is thick. He is. Dude. You know, and that's a thing saying, it's it, a saying with girls now, like she got that Mewtwo. Mewtwo I know, yep. I know. Oh I, god! I've seen that a oh, lot. Oh, probably Lickitung because because, oh, because and yeah. who owned a Lickitung? I don't. Oh remember. my god! Jesse, oh, Jesse owned a Lickitung. They're what perverts. the fuck? They're perverts. Did you guys have whenever you were like kids? Yep. The school tried to take away your Pokemon cards. For oh them my being god! Satanic. Yes. Dude. Because they couldn't con- they couldn't control Dude, us. the pocket monsters. Yeah, I, was I like, remember. I was like Batman. Because yeah. the professor would take away my buddy's cards. Right. And then I would steal them back. From the professors. Oh my god! Yep, look at that. Did that- you, like actually? So, did y'all ever have your phone confiscated in class? Constantly. Yes. Really? You yeah. gave? The, I told them to fuck off. No, I said, "I can't give your phone." Because no, I would just take it back. Is that easy? Yeah. You just take it back. They can't do shit. Fuck them. There was one time this kid got his phone stolen in my school, and he whipped his dick out whenever the teacher was gone and took a piss on the teacher's desk. Oh wow! Yeah, no then kidding. he got expelled. <laughs> That was back just, when men were just men. Just in front of everyone? Yeah. Oh, wow. That was back when men were men. <laughs> yeah. You just gave me flashbacks. I had a buddy called Billy... F- okay, I'm not going to say his full name. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we had a library teacher and we had to stay after for summer school. And he was really angry at the library teacher. And the library teacher said, uh, John, sweetheart, can you go out and get me some tea? Like a can of Arizona tea? Yeah. And I'm like, okay, whatever you say. I even forget the lady's name. And he's like, yo, give me that can so I can drag my nuts on it. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> like, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And so he did. So you let him do it? Yep. 
god. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Dude, people used to do the stupidest fucking shit. Yep. Like, I actually, you know what? I took my video camera to high school a few times just to record some of the stupid shit that would happen because I knew nobody would ever believe it. <laughs> yeah, I, I knew. I was like, there's no way that people would ever believe that all we did was just play Counter Strike all day, every day. Yes. So I went in there and I fucking recorded it. There it is. Well, you actually played Counter Strike? That's actually, yes. I, I played 1.5, 1. 1. Uh, 1. 1.6. Yeah, there back you go. in the day, my older brother worked at a Best Buy in Ohio. And mm -hmm. uh, in the back room, they had a little LAN area yeah. where they had all these computers set up. There was. Counter Strike 1.6, yep. old Unreal with the first physics engine. Un, yeah, yep. Unreal tournament. Yep. And then there was Quake. Remember yep. that? In Battlefield 1942. Oh, we didn't have that one. So, anyways, we play yeah. 1.6 all the time. Oh, yeah. And that was my first. I was one of those kids with the high pitched voices and the Game Boy Advance. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I, I think that's yeah. crazy because like when I'm scrolling on TikTok, I don't remember what people look like like I, 10 videos later. I've talked to people for weeks and I forget who they are. <laughs> yeah, I think I just have dementia though. <laughs> I think that's, that's probably a problem. I mean, those were solid B BLJs. They really were. Those that was were great a, that was a good clip. I'm washed up on those now. Can I bring up okay. something pretty serious I'm pretty nervous about? Okay. Is this, um, is, is this about the Ark Knights shit? No. Oh, thank God. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm uh, tomorrow I'm going to the dentist. Oh, oh I, yeah, I went for to the, the first, first time in how long? 13 years. 13 years. Wow. Yep. Please. Okay, yeah. hold on. I went to the dentist for the first time last week for the first time in yeah. like, uh -huh. what, like 10 years. I have fillings that completely fell out. Yeah. And I have been like eating weird for like years because of it because I never went to the dentist. Uh -huh. So I'm actually finally getting taken care of yeah. as well. I'm I mean, gonna be okay. I'm just scared. You're gonna be okay. Yeah. Like, do they still do the thing where they grab the metal pick and they scrape you? No, they will not do that. really. They will. Uh, like, oh, they're not really no. gonna fuck around. They did with it that. to test my old feelings. I, it's yeah. better. It's better when you're older. Like when you're a kid, I feel like it sucks more. It's more. It painful. is so scary. You will be like, okay. They, I have the worst dental anxiety in the world. I was okay. You'll okay, be okay. My problem is I can't breathe good out of my nose. I can breathe just a little bit out of my nose. So if they put shit in my mouth, you will die. I'm so sorry. It'll be it's okay. A, oh, I used no. to be so terrified whenever they would show like hostage situations and the person would have their mouth duct taped because I can't really breathe through my nose either and I yeah. thought I would fucking die. Yeah. Uh, dude, I had the same fucking yeah. fear. Yep. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. But I, I've been told they'll like put a hose in, they'll suck out the saliva and the water so that way I can still breathe out it's my mouth. It's not a big deal. Yeah. Like, what was the last I, time you went? Uh, I don't know. Like probably eight months ago, something like that. Because oh, they shit. like fixed the bottom teeth. Yeah. Okay. No, I've had to go a lot. I mean, fuck. They basically, I showed up and they said, you need to start coming back here a lot. Yeah. <laughs> they said, I'm like, which ones are wrong? And they said, yes. Wait, so did you keep going? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm, no, I've, I've had like a bunch of them. I'm getting a tooth completely removed. Oh, they have to take it out. They have to yoink it out. And they're going to try and save another one over here. I might lose that one as well. I've had like 10 teeth pulled. Yep. But yep. I think I'll just, I think I'm going to let that gap just chill out back there. I think it'd be I funny. Mean, I used to, I used to bleed from my mouth all the time. I do. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's why my wall's dirty. Yeah. I oh my that. God. Yeah. But, but I got this, this fluoride rinse that I use for two weeks and I don't bleed my mouth anymore. Really? Wow. So, so I'm thinking I'm like, good. I'm, I I want to get like six teeth removed because my teeth is jam packed. I have all my wisdom. Really, I want to get them fucking oh jaw Getting always... your wisdom teeth removed fucking sucks. Yeah. Really, I remember I didn't mind Wait, why? It at all. Wait, why well, does it suck? Oh, you look really scared. I have. Wait, okay, so I, after you get them removed, this is actually the fun part. So you're gonna be loopy on drugs, and it's really funny. You should have someone film you for like the hour or two after you get picked up. Yeah, and then your mouth's gonna be numb. And then you're gonna have to take these painkillers every day, and you're gonna have to wash out the holes in the back of your mouth because food's gonna get stuck in it. Oh, that's so fucking gross. I had mine I ripped out with that. pliers. Oh well, you okay? Ripped your yeah. shit with pliers. No, I, I I had a I ha mine got infected, and uh, I had to go. Uh, this was I was broke and everything. I had to go. Yep. I was avoiding going to the dentist. Worst pain in my life, by the way. Oh my god, I went. They were like, they sit me down. They're like, this is serious. We have the infection is spreading. We have to r rip out your tooth right now. And I was like, oh my God, what? It took like less. I put one song on my phone. My tooth was out before that song was even over. Guy puts on pliers, boom. Bro, they just go crunch, <clears throat> crunch, yeah. crunch. It was almost so comedic that like I was almost about to laugh. It was like yeah. a cartoon. <laughs> um, but when he ripped it out, the relief was so amazing because the pain was that bad. That's nuts, dude. It outweighed my fear of the dentist. How did you put a? How did they put a plier in your mouth? Well, well, they, I mean, they're they're they professional plier. Back there. They're oh, professionals. God. Yeah, but it's so big. Those no, no, they're huge. like handheld pliers, bro. Yeah, yeah, they're. <laughs> that makes they my heart sweat. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what the yeah. fuck? Okay, what do you think? Like, <laughs> 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 yeah. Okay. All right. They've mastered that, but I ended up walking back home from that. Paid three hundred dollars, walked back home. Holy shit, man. Damn, yep. that, was, that was badass. I remember like I've had some of them pulled and it was like very, very, very unpleasant. I yep. fucking hate getting them pulled. Yep. I got Botox awful. last week. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember you talked oh, yeah, about for that. Your head for your headaches, migraines. Look, look, Does look, it actually work? Yeah, I can't, can't tell at all. Oh my God. Look, look at my, look at my wrinkles on my forehead. Oh, uh, yeah, they, they, they I don't. I like barely any now. I have like barely any. I used to have a fuck ton. Oh, I thought that the way it worked was like you weren't, you couldn't move your eyebrows, but you're, your eyebrows raised the same. Yeah, but like on my forehead, completely smooth. I haven't had a, I haven't had a, I have not it's had like, a headache since. It's, it's like preventative Wait, Botox. So where they put it like here? Uh, 
okay, so he was like doing mid operations. Like he was, he was like, oh, we well, need a little bit more here. He literally just sat me on a seat and went, uh, like he, I fucking it, the headaches were like focused here. So he oh. went a fuck ton right here, and then he went like, and he took, oh, you need a little bit more on your eyebrows. And oh, I was yeah. done in like two minutes. Can't t- I mean, it's, it's like not cosmetic. It's like for migraines, but like can't tell at all. Like yeah. you still can like move your eyebrows. No, so well, if you do like this, does that hurt? Oh yeah, of course. It actually, it actually hurts more. Oh, okay. That's what I mean. Oh, yeah, it, yeah. It's like sensitive. Wait, whenever now? you yeah, did yeah. that, I could oh. hear it. It sounded hollow. That's it. That no. has nothing to do with the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, it was only like 200 bucks and I haven't had a headache really? since. It's been like a week. Wow, Interesting. Okay. There it you is go. nice. Lift your eyebrows up. Oh, you see? Look at that. Me and I you. know, I know, I know. You get that shit smoothing out. Yeah, I know. Oh, mine's pretty bad too. Tectone yeah, you get promoting that. unrealistic beauty standards. Hey, hey, Look I at his told, fucking forehead. I have been telling <laughs> that everybody. That's not real. <laughs> dude, first of all, my head feels good as fuck. Uh, it's so smooth and I look like a testicle now. It's sick as fuck. Oh, I've wow. been telling everybody that I got Botox. I ain't gonna lie to nobody. The surgeries I get, I will tell everybody. That's I've not even a, even a surgery, but I feel yeah. like that is a good thing to just like tell people. Yeah. Ask. Yeah. I mean, hey, if it improves your life, which Botox improves a lot of people's life and it's preventative in most cases, just prevent wrinkles from getting worse. Dude, um, there's nothing wrong with that. I used to end stream because I would get killer migraines. Really? Right? My stream hours before the surgery were like three, four hours. Now, post-surgery, I'm doing like nine hours every day like they're nothing. That's mm. crazy. Damn. It is okay. the is best. Like, the best. How I long do you have it. the migraines? Like, years? Oh, yeah. So long. So, so long. You Rock can actually you. get Botox for clenching your jaw all the time, I'm which I that. do. I have the worst tension headaches as a result of clenching my jaw which and like grinding my teeth all the time. I'm doing that the whole podcast. People can see my, people have brought it up in my stream. They're like, why are you going to move your jaw like that? Yep. I got this thing called like AGP or some shit you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, TMJ. TMJ, yeah. TMJ. Yeah, yeah. Do you have that too? Too much jaw. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I got, <laughs> Is that what it's I called? Got, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's called something more scientific but I just call it too much jaw. Right. That's what it basically comes down to. Yeah. Wait, do you want to hear it? What's on this? Eli, you can hear the from over Is here. Gross? Happens all the time. Like, I do it, like, <laughs> thousands of times a day. Ow, oh, that God, sounds I'm sorry, so... man. I know. Uh. Do you like that? That was wild. Oh, my God. Is it, like, kind of, like, one. dislocating your jaw, like, right here? Yep. Oh, yeah, I do that all the time. Wait, yep. what? I hate it. How do you do that? Well, because all of my teeth, like, I don't have any back teeth. So, like, my, my jaw is not, like, aligned properly. Oh. Uh. Mm. Yeah. Well, you seem to talk and survive, so... Well, yeah, I'm Fuck pretty it. good at it. I got... I mean, yeah, of course. Yeah, but I'm gonna go get my shit injected. So 100. percent So you, it's tomorrow. You're gonna go to the dentist. Yeah, tomorrow. I'm going to the dentist oh, tomorrow. Wow. Don't know what's gonna happen. I'm hoping <laughs> yeah. to say I'm okay, but I'm 100 percent getting will, Botox inside my jaw. Listen, in my case, listen, I had smoked a a lot of cigarettes for 10 years, drank a lot of alcohol, didn't go to the doctor or dentist for all of that, and the dentist was like, "Listen, it's not actually as bad as it should be, and I don't understand why." He's like, you got two teeth that, that need to get removed. That's about as bad as it is. So that you is might be nuts. pleasantly surprised if you weren't as degenerate as I was. I mean, when I bite Think ice cream- Think about it like this. There's no way it's going to be worse than me. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, I, I can't bite ice cream. Can y'all bite no, ice cream? No, no, no. I have too many fillings. Can you bite ice cream, Mary? It hurts really bad. Ice cream Does is it unpleasant. Hurts, it hurts I, I can. I think it hurts almost everybody. Yes. When I, do it, like, I, don't, I can with your front teeth- yeah, because I don't have any. Any like, what? Well, all of the like nerve endings are like fucked oh. up. Oh Ow. my God. Yeah. That's actually OP. Yeah, it is. I know a lot of people just kind of like say, some people will actually just get their teeth removed and replaced. Veneers? So that way they don't really? have to deal with anything anymore. Like besides rappers, you mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh my <laughs> yeah, God. Some, some people will do that because they're, they're just over it. With That's the, the nuts. fake teeth veneers? Yeah, yeah, those are yeah, scary. Like you, you know what they do? They, they grind sh- your yep. real teeth down into little it's where nubs. you look like a fucking goblin. <laughs> yeah, and then and then they put <laughs> yeah. these like uh, like ki- the like nubs. I almost said keycaps. Yeah. These like teeth caps. But they are the nubs. There are keycaps. But you right. have to get them replaced because your teeth, your real teeth, are just nubs forever. Yeah. There's something a very unsettling when I see that. Those the, when you see people like pictures of people teeth like that, like well, the, that's like the, that's what people who are cannibals should look like. <laughs> yeah. You know, yeah. Why exactly. is that? They're, Why they're is like that a cannibal dull, teeth? They're thing? like dull teeth. Know. Like they don't look. Cute. They're like uncanny valley. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, that's what they look like before why, they why put the caps on. Because the veneers are like they're like perfect teeth. Like they don't like the way they're made of look. porcelain. Some so kind so, of so shit. they're white. They're like perfectly straight, but most of the time they're like too perfect. Like it looks a little off. You know. Yeah. 
Uh, some of them look. The some of yeah, them look really realistic. My, I told though. my uh, my guys. I said, "Look, mine are fucked up. Let's not be unrealistic here, okay?" So yeah. just yeah, have them look the exact same. Some as of them do now. sometimes they look really natural. Yeah, but I depends. say fuck it. Get them all gold. Yeah. And do a Gucci gang. Like Asmon, Asmon gold. gold. Yeah, yeah, there you go. What's up, bros? Oh, you don't say shit. Oh, you know who got veneers and like, they're little, like, they're like, they're okay, but they're like kind of uncanny. Is that that boogie, boogie. guy? Yeah, yeah. boogie. Bo yep. Dude, you would look sick as fuck with a gold grill. With gold? Uh, that, that would go. You think I should get a fucking grill? <laughs> that would be grill? wild. Dude, you should, you should yeah, get one. That'd be hey, so the funny. That would be, be wild. Sick. Yeah. Dude, you just need to post a picture with like no context. <laughs> that'd be so good. I would maybe get a grill. That's yeah, that so would be funny. fucking funny. Oh, that would be so sick. What the fuck? You need a grill and like a really thick chain. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll like talk to XQC's guy, find out who it is and you know, <laughs> just get one of those made for myself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know, like what would be like the, like if you had a big chain, I feel like you have to have something that's like at the end of it, right? Whether it's like a dollar sign or like some <laughs> kind of shit, you know? Yeah. I don't know what it would be. For you? Oh, I don't know. Uh, Mr. For, Mime. Mr. <laughs> yeah, Mr. A Mime. diamond stud in Mr. Mime. <laughs> yeah, and they go, good. why do you have a Mr. Mime? You go, because I fuck that. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah, I fuck yeah. that shit, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I feel like it, that's almost like the way that some rappers are is that the dumber it is, the more appealing it is. Because it's just like the person is like so ridiculous, they become a cartoon. Listen, oh, one million percent. Listen, in a lot of cases, the people that are making these rap songs yeah. are people kind of just friends that get into a studio, fuck around, and they're like, ha, this is hilarious. Yeah. People like the beat, and it's okay. Because yeah. people don't want to think sometimes when they're listening to music. They just want to hear like, and the beat sounds great and people are like oh yeah. my god Mr. Miyagi yeah mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah true it's as simple as that I think that's what it comes down to but if you look at it musically you're like this is so stupid this is really dumb yeah but like does it really matter if the musical like quality is low if people are listening to it you know mm -hmm. it's like everybody talks about how bad McDonald's is but why are there always people at McDonald's that's true. exactly that's that's exactly. exactly every Shmo Yoho song it's like the double rainbow all the way across the sky yep. everybody <laughs> knows it yep the what? double, what the fuck? Double rainbow all the way across the sky. What? Yeah, the yeah, yeah. So they also intense. did. They also did. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Oh yeah, I remember yeah. that. They they basically would do that song remixes. Like Two thousand and eight. Holy shit. Yeah, they were called Auto Tune the News back in the oh. day. That's true. Yep. Oh my god, yep. dude! What, I knew them as Smell Yoho, but they would always say Auto Tune the News. Yep. That was what they're, they're that was like yep. their early YouTube name. It what was the, the oh my goodness, oh my damn, you know? Yeah. And oh and my back goodness. it up, back it up, back it yeah. up. My yeah. daddy taught me good. Yeah, and then there's the <laughs> axe murderer guy. The oh. smash, 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 smash. Have see you that? seen that doc? No. Yeah. There's what actually the parts of his personality that remind Yeah, probably. Me of him. I could see that. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of like Adam's yeah. screen, the guy's like. The guy came up and he was smash, smash, smash. Yeah. He, just, he has your mannerisms. Uh -huh. He ended up being a killer. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? My man. There's a, doc there's a documentary talking about how he ended up being a psychopath. Really? And there was, he wasn't how actually many saving the he day. Get? He was actually just killing a guy that he knew. It's no, pretty wild. Kidding. You got to watch the doc. But why, did he, why was he killing him? real? Though? I thought he was a good guy. Well, that's what the doc is about. Everybody thinks he was the best guy in the world. You have to watch the documentary. It will blow your mind. And, it, and it's real. It's one of those Netflix, yeah. like, he just seemed like a nice guy. But Shows him going on to the night show, and they're like, uh -huh. you're so you're a hero. And like, mm -mm, but what they didn't know. But but is it real? Yes. Oh, my God. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, like, it's not like he's killing people all day. He just does it, and then he goes and he does something. goes goes to Walmart. Yep. Yep. He was unfazed by the fact that he killed. And some people questioned it and looked into it a little bit. Yeah. And it turned out there was a relationship between him and the person who he ended up killing. Right. Well, what was the relationship though? He ended up staying at this dude's house like days ahead of ahead of that. It's like he got he ended up getting arrested and everything and like oh, investigated. That sucks. It's wild. That's chaos. I think he's in prison. Like wheel of chaos. I might I can't remember if I'm remembering, but he might be in jail. Do you remember well, that I mean, like, game show? Just want to make sure we talk the about the wheel that. of chaos. We need to talk about it's so how next the, like, Thursday. It's I think. next Thursday, thirty first. Yep. How does it work? 
I, there, think, I think there's a wheel, right? There's a wheel and okay. there's chaos spinning In the, the wheel. wheel that's determined. And there's probably a wheel and you yep. spin it and something stupid happens there's because of the wheel. There's also a charity aspect, I believe. Oh, really? Okay. Yep. Yeah, I'm, so I'm going to be on the first chaos to a charity. Right, so what yes. happens is there's a big machine and you drop the coin in and if you don't miss the, if you hit the Taco Bell, then you get a free taco. But then if you miss it, then you get the money to charity. Okay. Oh, really? So it's Wheel of Fortune, but with activities and No, it's and Wheel tasks. of Chaos. Wheel of Chaos. Oh, Yes. So wait, yes. Was, so was Taco Bell promoting gambling all the way back then? Yes. Oh my God. But it was going towards kids. Charity, yeah. we assume. So now that yes. I've talked about Extra Emily's show, guys, so the murderer. Make, guys, so <laughs> get ready. Wheel of Chaos, Extra Emily. Next Thursday. Next Thursday, gamers. I'm just going to... I think it's the 31st. Let me check. I don't know. Because <laughs> they don't know. Like, I don't even know Wait, what no, no, when this video is. comes out, it'll be the coming Thursday, I think. Okay, good. Wait. Hello? I'm so lost. Yes, it'll be this coming Thursday, the 31st, when this episode's out. Do you think, <laughs> do you think people are still listening at this point? Oh, to the podcast? Yes. No. I don't... <laughs> Wait, that means what? we can say whatever we want. We can't because for the way I watch podcasts for the first 20 minutes, I'm like locked in. Well, yo, me as a guest, that makes me feel like I did a bad job. No, no it's, it's not no, your it's fault. Not, it's no, my it's fault. not like that. No, but I'm saying yeah. like, like well, can I we just, talk about yeah, no, fucking I get what Pokemon you're saying. It's like the, the beginning of the podcast, you're listening, and it's kind of like background noise. Yeah, no, 100%. Yeah. Or you fall asleep because that's what I put podcasts on to sleep. Really? Right? That's what I do. I know what the thumbnail is. It's a picture of you three. Yeah. And then a picture of Mr. Mime and say, I'd hit that. <laughs> oh, good. I'd smash that. <laughs> we asked Seer which Pokemon would he fuck. <laughs> and now, a word from our sponsors. Hi, I'm today's sponsor, Mint Mobile Enthusiast Emeru. I'm also a world renowned actress who's won multiple prestigious awards. Hello? Oh, hey, Ryan Reynolds. Yeah, I, I can let them know. No problem, Ryan. Jay, that's the wrong Ryan. I told you only to pick up the phone for Gosling, the Barbie one. <sighs> Ryan Reynolds wants me to let you know that Mint Mobile offers premium wireless service for just 15 bucks a month. Don't get ripped off by big wireless providers anymore. Save yourself some cash. Mint Mobile's secret sauce to their cheap plans is simple. They cut out the cost of retail stores and operate online only. That means those savings pass straight on to you. And you can use your own phone with any Mint Mobile plan. So switching is easy. Their plans all come with a limited talk and text, plus high-speed data delivered on the nation's largest 5G network. Jay, if I pick up the phone and it's not Gosling, I might do something extreme. To get your new wireless plan for just 15 bucks a month, and to get the plan shipped to your door for free, go to mintmobile.com slash steak. That's mintmobile.com slash steak. Cut your wireless bill to 15 bucks a month at mintmobile.com slash steak. Do you think those surprised faces on YouTube are ever going to go away? I think everything changes yeah. like eventually what's the, over the course What's of time. the next meta for like YouTube thumbnails? Well, think about it in terms of movie posters, right? Yeah. Movie posters, there's a meta every time of uh -huh. what it should look like. It happened in the 90s. It happened in the right. 70s, 80s. Eventually, everything changes. I don't know how it's going to change. I thought about like maybe making the new thumbnails, making them look like a, you know, like a news announcement that like a terrorist attack happened to like yeah. make people like really anxious and worried and get them to watch a video about like <laughs> Hollow Cure. Okay, so how about oh, this? Oh, please play uh, Hollow Cure by the way. How about this? Go ahead. Yeah. Thumbnail for this video. Yeah. Just New York, right? Title: New York bombed, and then Peggy's out. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then at the bottom again. <laughs> Let, let's test the theory. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Let's see what happens. Oh. I want to talk about Hollow Cure for a second, sir. Okay. What, what, Vampire so what is this? Survivors cult classic, one of the greatest yes. games ever put on Twitch that you've honest, never played. That I never played, but always watched. Okay. Then I played fucking Hollow Cure because I saw Asmongold put a video called. This game changed my life. So then I played Hollow yeah. Cure, and then I made a video called This Game Saved My Life. Oh my God. Both of which performed very well. Wait, well, so yeah. wait, yeah. can I do one that says This Game Ruined My Life? Yep. I hope so. Yep. Because it's with VTubers, so it could make I'll take sense. The if you're I'll take the tier to them. three fall off trickle. Dude, okay. it is 
ridiculously People good. actually called you out, by the way, in my chat. They said, did you know Tectone yeah. is copying your YouTube? Oh, no, yeah. 100%. And I said, what? yeah, I told them to do that. Yeah, legit. Yeah, 100 million percent. Yeah. I'm just like, yeah, well, Asmund does that. So I'm like, all right, so... I'll just do that. Yeah. <laughs> well, he easier. does it, so I do it. No, wow, it worked. No, that's crazy. Yeah, right, it works. Cool. It works. Man. I don't give a fuck. Gotta, so, love, gotta love the copy. So, place, like, huh? Hollow Cure is like vampire survivors, okay. yep. but it's with anime VTubers. Yep. I'm gonna write it down. Yeah, oh, it, it, and Bro. it's actually not dog shit. No, I, it is probably because Honkai Star Wars is my favorite game. The, okay. Hollow Cure is currently my favorite game. Writing it. Writing it. Because I got invited to play Dark and Dark with two of my best friends, Aethel and Yanners. Right. I couldn't even focus on the fucking game because I just wanted to play Hollow Cure so fucking bad. So you can get into this like Animal Crossing part of it. Yep. Where like Wait, you have- what? Okay, so huh? like, you know, like in Vampire Survivors, you just have like the maps. Well, Hollow Cure, you can go into like, imagine if all of the girls from Hollow, yeah. Hollow Live or whatever the fuck yep. had like a house- and they all like had a garden there and you can go fishing. That's cute. You can catch fish and you can click on the other girls and they'll be like question mark. And then if you keep clicking on them, it will make them mad and then they'll leave. Yep. What? That's cute. <laughs> yeah. They're like, oh, go away, Oni well, It's like the little, you know, like the red thing. It's like if somebody's mad. The yeah, little, like a little yeah, scribble yeah. almost. It, like, it does that. It's supposed to be a vein, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, the, the, yeah. the yeah. angry the triple vein. thing. It is bullshit because they don't have my favorite VTuber in there yet. Which Who is it? Marine. Really? Yep, y'all know Marine. I think that they should add new ones. Like when it's so crazy, like add new, like new characters, right? I think yeah. that would make it exciting. Like replace them with politicians, perhaps? Oh yeah. Have like, you know, add in like for Hollow Live. I think one thing that would be really good would be uh Dick Cheney. Yeah, Dick yeah, Cheney would be, be yeah. Who's Dick the guy that have a <laughs> shotgun? <laughs> Who's the guy that just uh completely froze at the the during his interview and just stared at the camera for Mitch a few McConnell. Seconds? Mitch McConnell. Yeah. Get him in there. And, and when you click on him so a bunch of times, he, he finally wakes move. up. <laughs> <laughs> Put Joe Biden in there, that's how you wake him up. Yeah. How how far have you gone in the Hollow Cure? How many hours have you I don't know. Back? I'll probably put like 10 hours into the game, maybe, okay. probably Wait, less. Okay. So tell me, will I enjoy that? Yes. Is this sponsored? No. No, it's it's actually a completely fucking free game. And it's super yeah, good. Yeah, I, I saw it's fan made too. Dude, it's not yeah. even like a studio or anything. I really feel like you guys are about to say, and it's available in seven different con countries. Well, now that you bring that and up. And if you use code. <laughs> yeah. I, I really so this, ever, is a, this is a good game. Yes, I, I'm covering Genshin and Honkai a lot right now. I'm considering also doing Hollow Cure. So how do you feel time. about Genshin now? Now that you played the new content? Uh, the, I was right about everything. So it, the game sucks? Uh, no, the game... And I, it was crazy because I brought on, I did like a, I did like an episode where I talked to a bunch of Genshin Conikers. So I talked like nine at the same time. Everything I said was 100% so right. So did you do that just so you could say that all of those people agreed with you yep. and like use them as a frame of reference <laughs> so you wouldn't get hate? Yep. And okay, that's smart. That's a good because idea. Because I brought in people yeah. that I knew couldn't be disliked because they were all right. well-liked people. Like yeah. I brought in like everybody's favorite theory crafter, everybody's favorite YouTube okay. short person. Yeah. And I was like, oh, oh yeah, you want to tell me I'm wrong now? <laughs> that's so funny. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, they, and you know what? Everyone's like, you know what? Techie's right. And also, my reputation has completely <laughs> flipped. Now, I will admit, the Arknights community has come after me again because, you yeah. know, they, they, don't, they don't like that I'm getting popper again because I'm playing Genshin Impact. The situation. They, they don't like that. Yeah, the, the, the incident, which, Jesus Well, the Christ. incidents. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to Wait, which, what oh incident? Mm -hmm. Is this the... Oh, oh no, he, okay. He, he, so no, this, I, said, I said which. Is this one I don't know about? The, no, this no, is the no, same you one. Know about so this is this the same? titty one? Huh? What were you talking about? Like Eula's boobs or something? No, I don't no, no, know. no, no, no. This is even dumber. This is the same thing okay. that happened when I first joined OTK. This is the reason why it fucked me up so much. Because when I joined OTK, there was a Reddit thread that said, who the fuck even is this guy? Okay? Mm. <laughs> because nobody knew who the fuck I was. Yeah. And there was a whole like 3,000 upvoted thread. It's like, oh, it's Tecton, the guy who caused drama in Arknights. We all remember the incident. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, what incident? And back then I was like, okay, it'll go away. When you killed all those people? <laughs> I mean, most people that read it are probably like, I'm not a weeb, cool. <laughs> no, no, you would- uh Oh, you, he fucked those losers up? That's what they do. <laughs> <laughs> you would be surprised at how many people took that shit seriously. And so I saw it again the other day. There was another thread about the Ark Knights incident. So I'm just like, fuck it. I'm just going to address it publicly. Okay, Because I've already talked about, I made a YouTube video on why I quit Ark Knights. Crazy video, by the way. If you haven't seen it, you should check it out. <laughs> why I quit Ark Knights. Okay, put out a tweet and I say, there is no Ark Knights incident because there was never a Ark Knights incident, okay? They make it sound like I fucking killed someone, okay? First of all, 
It never happened. Why did you kill somebody? Okay. <laughs> well, he killed somebody's career. He made them quit content creation entirely. That was in Genshin. That wasn't Arknights. Oh, that was somebody else. Yes, that's because I said Zhongli was good. And then he's like, okay, you know, I'm going to quit YouTube. That was crazy. Yeah. Uh, anyways, I, I make a post and I say, there is no incident. This thing never happened. And I even put fucking sources in it. I finally just said, fuck it. I will actually research and just put sources of everything I'm saying. Nobody's saying shit. Now. Oh, yeah. I said this before we record. Yep. I was like, I went to your posts and I was like, looking for the, the hate comments. And I was like, damn, they're really quiet this time. Yeah. This is crazy. Yeah. Where's the people? So, they're like, yes, you did. You ruined the game. No, because I have <laughs> sources that I didn't do it. They have no sources that I did it. In well, the yeah, but you just give them a week and they'll be like, yeah, but why is he trying so hard to prove that he didn't do it if he did oh, yeah. it? Yeah, I, I saw one person say like, if you have problems everywhere you go, it's probably your fault. People were yeah. like, but what happened? And he just like couldn't reply. Yep. <laughs> right. Because because the thing is, it was one group of people that has fucked me up and they just keep saying it. And that's why the problems occur. Because they say, oh yeah, the Arknights is right. I said, okay, no, I didn't do it. Here's the source. Here's the source. Here's the source. Done. It Move doesn't forward. matter. I'll still get another Reddit thread about it. Like I should bring up your tweet on my stream. That way somebody can make a Reddit thread about why you were lying. Yep, I know. And then I'll read that thread. Yeah, there you go. And you know the exactly. worst thing is? So this thing that they're saying that I did, okay? Yeah. You would assume it's like, I mean, you got to understand, there's some pretty bad fucking people on Twitch. Yeah. There's some pretty bad shit. Like The me. incident is just them saying, he said this character was good when it wasn't. Have you guys ever had a situation where you were bored and you started hate, like you you started hate about yourself? Um, because well, like, I mean, I do do that when I'm like looking in the mirror and when oh, I'm driving, when I'm driving the well, car. Well, besides, well, what that, do you what do you mean by hate? Well, like, like actual sometimes, hate. Sometimes, sometimes there would be like drama, and I would know the right and the wrong side of it. And I would get intentionally involved on the wrong side just to read <laughs> negative comments about myself because I didn't feel like enough people were talking about me. No, dog, there's something wrong with your brain. <laughs> I mean, no, I actually, I think I do that. It's, I think sometimes I'll just yeah. say something really fucking, something that I just don't believe in just for, just for the fun of it. I, yeah. I think that's normal. That's gotta be normal. I don't think that's normal. Do you think that's normal? Well, I mean, are, you're not, you're like joking no. though, right? That's normal. Well, you know, I'm joking 100%. Yeah, yeah, that's normal. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, and also, yeah, the Genshin update's good. Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, swimming is fun. The new story quest is really good. Wow. But Sumeru was not good. Wait, the swimming's actually good? It's actually good. Oh. Did you see my comment on your Genshin post? Or sorry, my comment on your, was it your- Tower of Fantasy? Yeah, the Tower of Fantasy yes, post. Did. Yeah. <laughs> People <laughs> actually took that seriously. I know. Please, so please don't play that game again. You know what I did on yeah. Twitter that's made my experience so much better? Mm. I finally made one of those lists- or you can like make it so you can like add people to it. I added everyone in OTK, then like four more people. I don't even look at my feed. I just look at that. So I see like all your guys' posts and all your replies. Oh, that's and I'm amazing. Like, this is so, yeah. Wait, I can maybe like let you see my list so you can follow it if you want. I would love it's like that. All makes of, life well, easy. You might want to add like your roommates or something, but I can show you how to do it. It's I really don't easy. Know. I mean, no. like, <laughs> yeah, I, I do I, not. I, I don't know if I can give up like seeing people die in car crashes. Yeah. I mean, my, randomly. My, okay, my yeah, feed well, is you... just boring, to be honest. <laughs> I'll give it a but. What's your, what's your feed like on Twitter? Like, what, what is a serious It's feed? movies, art, music. Mine is gotcha and porn and then my friends. Yeah. Mine is all of the worst things. <laughs> oh, my God. All you the definitely worst. perpetuate that algorithm, don't I you? I do. You're good. <laughs> yeah, I can I see you sitting there, watch a guy get obliterated by a helicopter, and you're like, holy shit. I don't dude. even know what mine is because I get, like, extreme, like, "Quote unquote SJW stuff." I also Ooh. get extreme right wing stuff. Yeah, I get porn. So you I get like random. <laughs> so it's working. I get random gaming community drama. Like I, I get like league drama and like random Ugh. fucking games I don't even play. So and I'm like, like, what do they think I am? Like, what demographic is this? Like, they just <laughs> give me everything. Yeah. Somebody with too much time, dude. The same <laughs> yeah. thing happened with my YouTube shorts. <laughs> I started watching these ASMR slime videos. Uh -huh. And my YouTube shorts were like the absolute like degenerate, like like drag humor to just like, I think they think I'm a little girl. And they're sending me like Conrio <laughs> shit. Like, like look at this cinema roll. <laughs> oh, I, yeah, I wish more apps like showed what they think. So like for, for Twitter, um, they let you like set your gender, right? If you want mm -hmm. to. But if you don't, it'll guess for you. I didn't know this. Oh, I, like uh, I don't know if they like, okay, so... But it, I think they like use it to curate your feed. And I don't know if this is still on there because this was like two, three years ago I found this. Mm. I have I had two Twitter accounts on both. They thought that I was a guy because of what I looked at. What the fuck? Like they're like, you this user is male. 
<laughs> wow. <laughs> but I mean, it's like I follow like e-girls in video games. So. Oh yeah, yeah, probably. That makes sense. I'm wondering what the drama was like back in the day. What you do know? you mean? Like these days we have like Twitter and like, oh my God, can you believe that Tyler once said uh, the, the yeah. Arsler? What do you think, like, the old shit Okay, was? I don't well, think he did that. Well, well, yeah, sorry. <laughs> well, well, so, like, uh, well, the old drama. Okay, so, like, what was some old drama? Do you remember who the fuck was it that brought, that had their titty out in the Super Bowl halftime show? Yeah, it was, was it celebrity Whitney Houston drama, or something like that. Scandals. Yeah, celebrity drama. That's if, if all a nude, it was. If, if you found out that a celebrity had sex and had a naked picture, it was, it their was life was deal. ruined. Oh, my God. Dude, when Kim Kardashian had sex... That yeah. was awesome. Okay. I didn't even see that. I've never watched that. Either. Yeah, oh, bro, I've never watched saw it about a hundred times. Wow, that shit was crazy. They even they even did an HD remake of it. I mean, she became like a billionaire because of yeah. it, right? I mean, that's like pretty fucking good. Well, like her, her whole her family par- became billionaires. Well, no, her dad was also the lawyer. The lawyer for OJ. OJ. Yeah, I yeah. saw that. What who, the who, fuck? Who did Kim Kardashian fuck? I don't know. Ray some J. guy. Ray J. Ray J. Yeah, there was a porn star called Layla Starr, and she did an HD remake of the sex tape, but this time with good angles. Really? Wow. Yeah, it was, it was like RP'd out and everything. She was RP'd as Kim Kardashian. Jesus. Yeah. You know? Yeah, that was the way it used to be. It was, was always gospel. like celebrity drama and yep. like just stupid shit like that. The tabloids. And people really yeah. latched onto it. People still get into tabloids. Like oh, I yeah. see it now. Yeah. Oh, the, the current one is probably like the, the Ariana Grande thing. What about it? Oh, about her like getting that guy to leave? Yeah, she. Her, well, yeah. Uh, I don't even know if this is all even like confirmed true, but apparently she's dating some guy that just had a kid and left his wife to be with her. So they're like calling her a home wrecker or whatever. Being Break like, up oh, this with your guy, because I'm bored. This guy, he's just going to get dumped by her when she's bored and he's going to yeah. have no wife and kid to go back to. Like, I, I don't know. Oh yeah, it's some of that crazy shit. And it's like, also, that's pretty bad, you know? It's like nothing crazy, like the Doja Cat stuff. Did you see that? Like this happened like a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, she she, she lost like a hundred thousand yeah. followers, and she yeah. was like, "Good." She had like a bunch of these like <laughs> <laughs> kind of <laughs> base. <laughs> so they, <laughs> I'm gonna just say it. Like that, people said some fucked up shit. So like Doja Cat was talking about like how she didn't like her fans being like super parasocial, mm-hmm. and her yeah. fans went and said that she needed some lashings. Oh my Straight god! Fucking up. what? Yes. Well, and it's like I'm reading these comments. She like also like finds the, the schizos. I feel like well, yeah, I mean, she, fo- she focuses on it and well, responds to it. Basically, to. Yeah. I think, and this I don't know if you guys agree or not. Um, I think that it was probably not her fans, and I think that the, the the community is getting smart enough to where when somebody says something or somebody does something. They can act like a fan in order to get away with shit while posing as a that, fan. That is true, but so I, like, I think it's also true some of her like, fans like, are just like, really entitled. I think that I think that all of the fans of all pop stars, one of the biggest contingencies of fans of people like that and K-pop and a lot of anime and Genshin Impact are mentally ill preteens. Yep. That is just the truth. Yep. And they're on the internet. Their profile picture is Taylor Swift. And if you yep. say anything they don't like, a neurodivergent, they don't interact. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah, do not. Like they interact. will start an argument, and, then, and they're like, "I'm neurodivergent. Do not interact with me." And to be honest, Jesus. that's like a porcupine, right? Like yeah. a, a, it's like an internet porcupine. Yep. Thank you. Yep. Like yeah, yeah. thank you. Like I appreciate you. See, for the Genshin community, it's, right. if you want to know if you want to not interact, it'll be it'll be a character from Genshin Impact will be wearing a McDonald's hat. Really? Yep. So why is, oh, yeah, is it because the people in yeah. real life live and work at McDonald's? I mean, uh, I guess. No, I, I think what? it's just because the, those are really popular icons. So uh-huh. like, of course, like a bunch of the dumbasses are going to have it. So yeah. like, what kind of stuff did they say? Yeah, what, what, what's up with the McDonald's hat? Is that a nice yeah. thing? You know what? How does this I've, work? I've gotten to the point where I've accepted against what it is. I actually greatly enjoy it now. I'm not even kidding you. Because, I, because I've given up on the combat. It's never happening. But I, I never understood it. But mm-hmm. it's been just like, okay, this guy is saying that I'm racist because I didn't like Yunjin singing. Yeah. And then I look at their profile picture and it's Zhang Li working at McDonald's. And I'm like, right. okay, I'll just go, I'll just move past Did that. Did you one. see? So apparently they added a femboy into Genshin Impact. Oh, no. And the Koreans were not fucking having Wait, it. Are you, you are you know talking about, about Scaramouche or a new no, femboy? No, uh, Lene. 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 Do you know about that? That I, caught wind to you? Any. Anything, anything that people on the internet who are mentally ill do, I know about it. I just wait. Oh my so God. is it is it because they're like homophobic or like because isn't that just so like a young boy it's character? Really simple. Like what? Yeah, it's really yeah. simple. 
girls should look like Victoria's Secret models mm -hmm. and guys should look like Arnold Schwarzenegger or Ronnie Coleman. And but whenever they are, see a guy, isn't the character like whenever 12? they see a guy no. No? looking like oh. a girl, then that's a fucking problem. That's it. And th th dude, that's crazy how you are starting to get the fucking weird ass shit that happens in that community. And that, well, that's just the way it is. Did you make a YouTube video on it? Of course. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. Course, Thank God. Course, yeah. cool, they dude. can't get away with this shit anymore, man. Because if you know about it, they're fucked. Th this has to be like a vocal minority, though, it right? It is, but it's funny. Well, well the dislikes okay. are more than the likes on the video. Really? The Koreans, yes. dude. Just because yeah. he's a femboy? So, so think about, uh, every, yes. think about wow. every Korean MMO. Mm -hmm. Are there any femboys in those? I don't fucking know. That's right. <laughs> That's right. You go Lost Ark, there ain't no fucking femboys there. Dude, I will say this shit. I'm going to give some praise yeah. to Genshin Impact. Uh, you're, you get, you're not going to play it. You might play it. Can I, talk, can I talk about a story thing that happens? Oh, I don't, I don't care about spoilers. Dude, yeah. They, they really upped their, their story. They used to kill like nobody. There's been like two deaths in like three years. What would happen if they killed Hu Tao? Well, she would just come back to life. Well, well, what would happen if they killed her for good? Like, what, oh, what, would, well, the, that, what would the community well, do? They would, well, that would not be good. <laughs> that is their baby, man. That is yeah. their baby. Uh, they introduced one of the best characters of all time in Genshin. Her name is Farina. She's the water archon. Oh. Super charismatic. Incredible. They also killed like seven people and they showed it. Like there was this guy talking and then all of a sudden he just gets fucking vaporized. Oh my God. It was so cool. And then they even talked about, there's this character called Lynette. And it's the sister of Lene. Yeah. And they literally talk about this in the story where she gets she gets brought into a child orphan sex ring. Yeah. When she's like 12. Right. And then this character called Arlecchino slaughters the guy who was in charge of it and like 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 covered herself oh, in the blood so of their character. Yeah. That's nice. Yes. So like they're getting into like some very gritty themes. Jesus. Because wow. I think they're getting into harder topics because Zen Because Zone a Zero, lot of their their fan base is now getting into high school. Yep. Yeah, they're <laughs> getting involved. Yeah. It's because that's why Zenless Zone Zero is 16 and up. Have you seen the gameplay of that? I've seen so much of it. It's very good. It's so good. I cannot Yay, new fucking games. wait. I'm so glad I'm out of my league-only rut where I actually enjoy new games now. Yep. It's You're not so taking good. cold showers to punish yourself for playing a shitty game? I haven't taken a cold crazy. shower in three years. Wow. That is crazy. Wow. <laughs> but I did play Thank a game of league Andy. last night, and I won. Yes. You won? Oh no, does that mean it's gonna start again? No. Oh my god. You didn't I get a high I just play like it? one or two games every So couple whatever of happened nights? to that thing? You said that they were changing the ranking system, but you wanted to do it again? What where did that Oh yeah, every time I say that like I'm gonna get to Diamond and League before a certain amount oh, of time, so it, it never happens okay, because yeah. I have to play a hundred games and then I'm like, wait, I don't Jesus, actually wanna do that. Long. Wait, why don't we play a hundred games? Probably less than that, but I mean it's not like playing for two nights and then you're diamond, you know what I mean? Seer, you know what I noticed? What? You don't know what the fuck these games are, do you, bud? Listen. What <laughs> game? What games have you played recently? Um, Runescape. Did no, you finish you've, Souls recently? I've gone through. I go through a lot so of games. So you beat Dark actually. Souls. You beat Dark Souls one. How was it? Uh, Dark Souls one, very, 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 Did very you satisfying. Beat the DLC too. Yes, I beat the DLC. Oh, I didn't get to watch that. Um, I went through. I one shotted the the final boss of the game. Yep. Um, O N S. Yes. Very much struggled with that. Uh, it was the very first time in my life that I actually closed chat. I, I really? was that angry? I, yep, for an hour. Wow. For an hour. I didn't look at what chat. What boss was it? It was ONS. Oh, was that boss? I, I, I was very, 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 very... I was struggling so bad with that. I closed chat for... Um, what's the guy that fucked Abyss Watchers. Dorsal? Yeah, Abyss Watchers. I closed it. That was. Have you seen my reaction to Abyss Watchers? I've I've seen a clip of it. Not the. Whole I hope thing. you never see it because that's a really ugly side of me. I don't like people seeing that actual side of me. It's so really you know, ugly, like bad. whenever you know how you can't tab out properly, there's like no borderless window. Yeah, mode just like of, explodes. So like yeah. you know if like the resolution <laughs> changes, he's tabbing out. Yeah. And then he looks over to the other side and he's reading chat, oh and then God. he looks back to the game. You know, you just fucking banned somebody, right? <laughs> oh I've my done God. that. I've done yeah. that. I've done that. I did that. I was doing yeah. that during Dark Souls. I did that last night. Yep. That's why I got so petty during a Dark Souls. Yeah. Oh my God. Boss no, that, battle. That's part of the experience. That like while I was boss battling, I'm trying not to read chat right there. Yeah. And I just see the thing that pisses me off. And I even got so petty that halfway through the boss you battle, the fight? yeah. I, I alt tabbed out, right. banned them, and let my self character die. Fuck them. Yeah. You know what's crazy? I'm going to do a hot take. I actually think you did great. 
I think you did Thank great you. in Souls. Okay, I think Wait, extra so Emily you, is you doing. You did every boss. Yeah, I beat it. What did you think it. of Manus? Um, that was the hardest one for me. So that's okay. Well, you beat Manus. Who is that? The fucking big black creature that has the black the dude arm, with the big the arm, arm guy the that like arm. he goes like, he goes like and all the souls fall from the sky. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. No, I know. I watched what? you do Artorius. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I went through. Oh, yeah, I, I watched him play Artorius too. I think I there was now. one maybe non mandatory boss that I skipped. Um, Did you kill the butterfly? Yes, killed the butterfly. Ooh, that's a hard um, one for some people. I didn't. I, some bosses were very easy, and yeah. some I've really, really struggled with. But I will have to give a lot of credit to my chug. My, you know, I did the force and build near the end of the game. Did you get the Havel sent? Uh, yes, I did. Ooh. Yep. Ooh. I sure did. But I was a big dragon tooth. I maxed out my dragon tooth. Okay. I loved the dragon tooth. I I got to the point to where I wasn't even mid rolling with the dragon tooth and I could still wear some armor. Okay. Max damage. I think it was 20. Is it, th what is it, thir 20 or 38? What, what is max damage? Thir 38. Well, strength. No max Sorry, damage. strength. Uh, fifth. 40. Yeah. Okay. Max. Yeah. Out. 40s were soft. A soft. Uh, I yeah. went in. My rolls were just time perfectly. Boom. Mm. I get greedy. I'm a very greedy player. I take it very personally. And I'm just well, like, one well, more, one more. Mm. And you I'm don't even I do need the same thing. thing. You're always greedy if you're using a weapon because you can stagger anything with the hits. Yep. Yeah, and exactly. I do power attacks. Oh, I, yeah. And okay, so this is what I do. All right. You know the lunge, the lunge power attack where you like press forward and you go, yep. like a leaping overhead strike yeah. and then you have to recover from it. I love doing that when I shouldn't be doing that. Well, you should and play I all always the open with that. Game. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so it was very satisfying. Mm -hmm. The thing is the mental toll that it takes on my fortitude yeah. is just so draining. Really? Yeah. And the satisfaction was paying off and everybody was there and it was amazing. And I'm back on Dark Souls 3 and I, I need to get back into How it. How far did you get? Dark Souls 3, I just beat, uh, I just beat a boss in the forest. Okay. Uh, so where you there's, did you beat that? It, like you have, to, you have to kill his, his like pimples and shit? Yes, yeah. I just destroyed him. Oh, the fucking just beat him. rotted yeah, great yeah, wood. That, that yeah, was the recent one. On that one. A lot Dude, of work. That one took a lot of work. Yeah, uh, I fucking bugged out on that her, one. Yeah, her fight unironically bugged out. Yep, yep. I think it happened twice, even. Mm -hmm. It's always. It's, I, I also was just being fucking stupid. Hey, right. you know what, Miyazaki, fix your game. And yep, this, is, I, I was saying this day. Yeah, there's day no Dark Souls out. battle pass. Where's yeah. the roadmap? Yeah, yeah. Where's this game going? And I was saying this all the all the way through Dark Souls. You know, I'm playing it. I'm like, Mizar, you fix your game, man. I keep dying. Like, yeah. come on. Like, I'm hitting block. Uh, I'm rolling through these attacks, man. I'm hitting those frames. I'm hitting those iframes. Right. Iframes. Um, I'm hitting those iframes. And sometimes it just hits me and I die. And I'm like, Mizar, you got to fix your game. It sucks, yeah. man. Dark Souls, it just sucks. But great game. I'm sure the fans of the series really appreciated you saying that. Yeah. Finally, somebody says it. <laughs> no, everybody. Yeah, everybody. Yeah. I had an email for it. You know, means I can fix your game. And uh, yeah. I'm playing Dark Souls 3 and that game needs to be fixed. I'm waiting for the patch. Just wait till Dark Souls 2. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's no, so, Dark, a, so I skipped bro, Dark Souls 2. It's smart. I skipped Dark Souls my 2. My buddy just played that. I was watching him. Oh my God. What a fucking fiesta. Like, what a fucking a fiesta? fiesta. It's. it's game, bad. It, you it know, it's bad. does Miyazaki need to fix it? Yes. Yes. He wasn't on it. So Dude. if he can't. Even make Dark Souls two. What's to say if oh, I he, die in Dark Souls three? Right? So what? Wasn't Dark Souls two a different person? It was a different director. Yeah. Oh, different oh director. okay. Then we're yeah. good. Then we're good. No, it's it's like bad, bad. Like it is, it is horrible. I I will say there are these people out there that like having these opinions, like oh, Elden Ring is bad and Dark Souls two is good. Those people are fucking morons. Yeah. Dark Souls two is dog shit. It's bad. It is a garbage game. And there are some redeeming factors, but there is an eight-hour video made by a guy on YouTube. His name is Mauler. And he deconstructed every single bad thing about Dark Souls 2. I need to watch that. I I've watched that. it twice. Oh, on stream? No. I, I probably, oh, yeah, I've done I it. For, watch I watched it, it for myself. So I did experience Dark, Dark Souls 2 fanboys. That were like, why did you skip Dark Souls 2? They were like, this because is it's very, bad. very upset. Yeah, it's a bad game. That's why it's, it's why most people skip it. I feel it. like a lot of people who say that, though, like, why'd you skip 2? It's like they know why. They're just like, oh, well, are they you going to play you it? Say it? We so want to see. Mad. Yeah, they, they want they want, they want to make themselves mad. Now, there's this other thing that I have a problem with Dark Souls 2, which, which is I believe I've beat it many times. 
as a matter of fact. No, you haven't. No, and, and that's what I think. That's the most insane thing I've ever heard. No, what's crazy is- What is this, like an alternate universe? No, okay, no, so there's a two years of my lifespan I don't remember. It was, it's like around like 19 to 21-ish. And I, I, I'm, what's wrong? I'm sorry, I looked up the video he's talking about. So there's In Defense of Dark Souls 2, which is an hour 45. And then there's part one, an hour, part two, an hour, part three, an hour 30, part five, yep. an hour 20. Like, what it's is a, this? It's a bad game. Jesus And so there's Christ. a lot to go over. Oh okay. my God. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Yeah, no, so, watch the whole thing. And this is a watch. crazy thing for me to say. I am pretty sure I've beaten Dark Souls 2 probably about eight times. By the way, I watched the whole thing while I was playing Dark Souls 2. I believe it. Yeah. But what, what I'm oh confused about is, even though I I think I've beaten it seven or eight times, which is just crazy to say out loud because I don't even believe myself right now. Yes. Because the, let me tell you why I think I beat it. Because yeah. because when I, when I first, I was talking to this girl about 11 years ago and I went to Walmart to buy a pair of sunglasses because, no, to wear a pair of glasses because she thought I would look cuter if I was wearing glasses. So I went to go buy it so I could send her a picture of myself. And then I went to go buy Dark Souls 2 it, when it just came out, but they charged me the price for Dark Souls 1. So I got a $60 game for $20. Okay. And Damn. I remember this all so clearly. And then I remember it so clearly playing it on my PS3. In Dark Souls 2, is there a mob where it's like fucking enormous, you're on a platform, and it takes its hand, and it goes like this? Kind of, yes. And when that would happen, I would say, here comes the big sweep. And I remember what? this so fucking clearly. But I just can't, I can't remember. And I believe there was also a part where you fall down a well and you need a ring to reduce fall damage. What? Yes, there is. Yes. It's, a, it's in the main area where the no, lighthouse no, is. I, I, and I bought the fall damage ring. ring and it still killed me. Yeah. Wait, wait. I, I am like positive I've beaten yeah, this game okay, so a lot. In, this isn't like a spoiler or anything. In Souls 2, in like the starting area, there's this well and you can see down, there's like all these like items on platforms. You're like, oh, I'm supposed to go down there. And then there's this shopkeeper you talk to that sells rings and they sell a fall damage ring. So you're like, oh, they're literally right next to this well. It must be, I get this ring and then I'll be able to live when I go down there. Yeah. So you work hard and save your souls to buy this 5, ring. And then you're like, yep. I'm ready. You jump in the well, <laughs> first platform, can. fucking dead. No way. Oh, Dark Souls no. is a game that just kicks you in the dick for no reason. <laughs> it uh, does do that. It does. And it, there's no reason. It knows why. what it's doing. I, I, I think it does. I, I, I'm really thinking about playing it again to like see if I'm unlocking memories of this game. Sometimes I want to play it again as a form of self-harm. <laughs> yeah. It should, yeah. Will I get banned on Twitch if I, I play think it for I should get, I think Twitch should ban me if I ever play Dark Souls 2 but again. I'm probably going <laughs> to goof around with it sometime and I'll let you guys know if I did beat it or not. Because okay. I'm not sure if I did, but I'm pretty sure I've beaten it seven times. But I'm I, also not sure if I've played it. I still want to beat it to be able to like, How far did talk you get? about it. Not far at all. I only beat like four bosses. Okay. So I mean, who's, the, who's the final boss? Uh, well, it depends because they had the end boss change because it used to be uh, oh like Narasha, Natasha, some fucking shit. And then it got changed to uh, the, the Aldi or whatever the fuck, the scholar of the first son. Baldi? Baldi, yeah, basically. <laughs> Baldi tree boy. Baldi? So, <laughs> yeah. Do you see Baldi Gillette? What? There's Baldi Gillette. It's like a new campaign by Gillette trying to make people seem like baller people are cool. Oh, God. Yeah, it's never going to work, guys. Dude, it's not going to work at all. It's, yeah. People will be like, it changed my life. It really, I shaved my head and I just became a new man. And to be fair, it's true. R slash yeah. bald is that, it's, it's, a, it's a community where they're like, you should be bald. It's for people to go that are coping when they are balding. And yeah, they're like, yeah. finally got the courage. I've been balding for three years. Finally got the courage. Here's the new me. And they're like, and they're like, they're yeah, bald. There he is. Yeah. Look at that. Gillette Baldy. Hey, he's a good looking guy. I want that sponsor so bad. But he'd be great for that. I agree. I will say this, okay? It takes a certain type of man to be bald. You could be bald. I could be bald. Miz can't be bald. I can't be hmm. bald. You can be bald. I'm too skinny. Who cares? You would look like you are part of an organization in prison. Yeah. <laughs> 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 that, weird, that weird plus sign thing, yeah. yeah but I also yeah. thought that that's also how I would look if I, if, yeah. if I... Yeah. That being said, you shaving your head and saying, oh, I'm too skinny, Camp Canute season two. Oh, God. And that's why oh, I did. Oh, fuck. Imagine that. You know, I've been yeah. getting jacked lately, and I actually... Uh -huh. So that's why I took a pause off of Dark Souls 3. 
to get you know, jacked. because I, I realized Miyazaki's not going to patch the game anytime soon. No, he's <laughs> so not. So I figured, hey, I got to work on my mental fortitude. Part of that is going to the gym and working on myself. Mm-hmm. Then I can get back in, get back in the dojo, and I think I'm going to start whooping up on Dark Souls uh, 3. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm not allowed to stop smiling while I'm playing. I'm going to smile through the entire rest of the game play like this. <laughs> Well, that's going to be... And whenever I die, I'm going to give a nice little laugh. <laughs> do you have a, a plan for what you're going to do after full So you're going to cosplay as extra two. Emily. Are you gonna, you're, you're definitely going to do two? I yeah. really I think you shouldn't. I'll smile my way through two well, and he, then I'll do Shakira as well. try it yeah. and then you can decide if you want to play it. That's okay. what I did. Well, I didn't try it on stream, but I basically tried it off stream when I was like, no. nah. But yeah, you would like Sek- Sekiro, just like the world. No. Listen, okay. I think Sekiro is incredibly beautiful. You know, it's just... You can't outscale it, and so you're scared. It's just so far. I got really frustrated with Sekiro. I've tried it three times it at before? the beginning. Yeah, uh, I yeah, just you, you not can't really enough yet. Or yeah. outscale it. You can't just use the dragon tooth and just wear Havel's armor and max out your stats. L two chug, L two chug. Yeah, you can't do R one chug. Actually, is a weapon that you can kind of do that in Sekiro. Which one? Yeah. Draw mortal blade. <gasps> Wait, really? I have that. It's really fucking good. What, like the? The the rant where he goes like, go woof, woof, like that. That's that good. Have you done it? Yeah. Uh huh. I haven't. I don't know anything about that. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, I, I think that's ins- that's further than you've gotten. It's fucking yeah. insane. I should really just pick up the game and just beat it real quick. It's like they put that in the game for games journalists. Mm. Oh, yeah. No. Right, another thing is like for. Most of my playthrough, I never used prosthetics. I was like, okay, I that's cool. That I don't care. And then I used the fucking axe prosthetic a couple times. Oh, and I nice. was like, yeah. now the game is easy. Yeah. <laughs> or easier. Were, not, I thought, not I thought easy, you had easier. to use it to, like, to break the shield, guys. No? That's only at the very beginning. You, you don't have to. And then like you can also use the prosthetics on like bosses and shit to stagger oh, yeah, I them. used, um, what's the oil and fire thing? There's like an oil and fire thing. Isn't there not? Isn't that Bloodborne? I think it's Bloodborne, yeah, dude. I really no, there was that. a no, boss. There was a, the you, big fat sumo guy. You can... Uh, d- put oil on enemies, and then you have like the fire prosthetic. Okay. I haven't, I haven't done that, yeah, but dude, I know no, you can do it. Shreds, like it fucking shreds. I never tried that. Oh, okay. No. Like, okay. Yeah, Every you- time I see in chat, I'm fighting a boss, and someone's like, "This boss is easy if you use this prosthetic or this item." I'm like, "I'm not using." Oh, it. Oh, okay. Well, then, all right. I guess I'm just <laughs> We're playing gonna the be game here for an extra three hours. <laughs> yeah, because I'm gonna do it the hard way for no fucking reason now. Oh, I, I do, yeah. I have to admit that uh, I did. S- I did uh, did something bad with Dark Souls one. No, so stop. What happened? I cheesed one of the bosses. Which ones? Which resulted in instant death of the boss. Oh, oh. yeah. Was it the Taurus demon? No, I bet it was the big lava guy. Yeah. Yep. Ooh. Yep. So you, that's you, apparently you, supposed to be like that. Though. You just run back and yep. the guy yeah. dies. No, and, it wasn't supposed to be like and that. Do you want to know even more? <laughs> I acted like I didn't know what I was doing. But you did? Oh, no. And I did it fully knowing that it was going to cheese it up. And wow. I was like, wait, guys, where's the boss? Where's the boss? <laughs> and everyone's like, easy, 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 easy. It's oh, really no. funny because I remember you had yeah. that happen too. I had the same thing happen, yeah. but I didn't know. Although I did see people in chat say like, run. But I thought that they meant like, you're not supposed to be here right now. So Don't I work. ran and then it left and I was like... What? I was like really, f- I was genuinely fucking confused. And people were like, you cheated, you knew this. Yep, there were like, a lot so like, of people. I did see people saying to run, but I didn't know that was going to happen. Yeah. Are you are you public about this? He's is this your first time talking about yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, should we edit it out? Or are you okay? No, no, you, you, you'd let them know. You let them know. <laughs> oh my God. I'm not going to do it again. I'm not <laughs> you acted on your stream like you didn't know. <laughs> yeah, That's yeah. So I funny. acted like I didn't know. Oh I, play, I actually God. played dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I used the weapon, weaponized, you know. <laughs> I uh, I actually did the opposite. There's a boss in Dark Souls 3 that you have to jump down and stab him in the head to kill him. And if you don't do it, it takes forever to kill him. And I read in chat that you had to do that. And I intentionally didn't do it. And I sat there and I hit what, his the, feet. The Capra Demon? The Wyvern. Ancient Wyvern. Oh, okay. I sat there for 30 minutes beating him to death. Jesus And Christ. I killed him. That's because I, I said, hate, I'm not going to let the chat tell me what to do. That's why I gimmick bosses where there's like only one way to beat it. Because it's there like, wasn't. I'm trying I to do it. it myself like the hard way. And they're like, you have to do this. And I'm like, <sighs> yep. so I actually have to like take their advice mm-hmm. now. So let me ask you a question real quick <laughs> before we conclude. Yeah. In Dark Souls, when you're live streaming it. Yes. And maybe you've experienced this because you seem it petty in the same way I am. Yes. When they I have. tell you that you need to do something specifically, 
Do you I do not do it I, I just don't. to spite them? Yes, yes. So because, I did that with armor. I they were like, them. put on some armor, put on some armor. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to be naked with to my dragon that. tooth. Yeah, I don't need to do I that. I did the same thing. Because yeah. I'm better than you. I, I'm the streamer. You're the viewer. Fuck you. Yep. That's oh, right. Oh, maybe so. Oh, man. They, I, I never was so petty until I played that game. I, oh, yeah. okay. I am the exact opposite. Yeah. I'm like, do you do this? I'm like, okay. Yeah. And, then, <laughs> and then it caused drama and only up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, you do this. I'm like, okay. <laughs> so, like, dude, and it's thus like, was born integrity it's, runs. It's like having, fuck that. So, it's like having, it's, but it's, it's no having one Google. actually cares. It's like having it's Google not. there. No. Yeah. And they Google everything I want. No, been. but it's the way they say it sometimes just makes me want to punch yeah, them. Yeah, sometimes in the it's face. so like, Annoying, it's like so condescending. Patronizing. Also, like for me, when I watch a stream, I want to see them like figure it out to some extent. Like if someone like helps them, like oh, you might want to try this. It's like fine. But if they explain to them every fucking thing, yep. to do it in the most optimal. Like you wouldn't even know this on your first playthrough game. Like I don't like that. And my, my chat doesn't do it. In the my chat's just like. Techie, you need I, to I wasn't talking about your chat. Oh, I just yeah. meant in general. Techie, Techie, put on the armor instead. No, the, 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 Techie, like, climb the wine bottle. Use the sword. <laughs> no, 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 no. Techie, Techie, fucking do this thing. Yomp, yomp, yomp. And I'm like, okay. It's like, yeah, in mine, it'll be like, maybe you should try wearing armor for once. Like Dumb something ass. like that. <laughs> Oh my God, it infuriates me. So if I'm not alt having banning him, then what I do is I double down <laughs> yeah. for a very long time. Then I act like I figured it out myself. And I'm like, oh. I Have you ever turned the volume armor. up whenever people say to turn it down? All the time. So if there's one that I can't hear you, can't hear you, muted, muted, I jack it all the way up and I yeah. scream as loud as I can in the microphone. Yeah. Oh, I just end the stream. That's what they get. Streaming oh, yeah? turns us into psychos. No, no, I'm yeah, it does. Okay, I'm going to try this. I did this for like two months. Anytime anybody ever bitched, I just end the stream. And now people don't bitch. Because if they bitch, they think the stream's going to end. Right. So like I was playing Hollow Live, Hollow Cure, and they said, the game's a little bit slow. Fix it. And I'm oh, like, all right, guys, God. I'll see you next time. Close <laughs> the stream. <laughs> uh, I, I come up next time, everybody's like, the game is perfect. Bro, <laughs> it is bro. perfect. I've done that <laughs> where, um, oh my God, this happened during lockdown. I can't remember. They triggered me so bad. I basically, what I did is I stopped streaming, but kept the stream running. So I basically full screened and just continued my about my day, going around my room, cleaning my room, watch YouTube videos, chilling on my bed. And I just streamed that for, for hours. And they loved it. They were subbing, they were donating, saying, pay attention to us, pay attention to us. And I just ignored them and acted like I wasn't streaming. That's smart. It was amazing. I'm, I'm doing that tomorrow. Yeah, it's Before amazing. This episode comes out the way nobody knows what's happening. Yeah. I'm doing that tomorrow. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna play games, they're gonna piss me off, and I'm just gonna I'm gonna clean my room. Yeah, just do and your own thing. Gonna, and they're gonna watch. Yep. <laughs> I think, I think so people funny. like those streams for some reason. They do. I, I did a stream where I cleaned my hamster cage and people fucking loved it. Yeah, they love so the, the POV into the room. That is cool. I actually cannot wait to do that. Yeah. Do you want to uh, do you want to read a review? Oh we haven't done that. That's right. We're getting to the near end because I'm starting to sweat. Yeah. Is yeah, it's yeah. very toasty in here. Oh, let's yeah. see. That's, is that normal? How that's, hot is it right now? A hundred and fucking four. Yep. Okay. Because yep. I realized my brain was starting to slow down as it yeah, got so hotter much, in here. Pretty much this room at the beginning of the podcast may sometimes start at max temp, but today it started at 7.2, and now we're heating all the way up to 88. Oh, so if you look through the video at the beginning, I'm probably like, <laughs> yep. and now yep. you're, no, yep. yeah. So yeah. Let's, let's go ahead and read a review. Yeah, let's read a review, guys. Oh, it's called Tectone. Please... Please huh. stop. Talking. I don't want to read. Oh my god. Let me god. read it. Yep. I don't want to read this. Let I'm me read good. it. That's you, Remy. That's that's you. I'm not reading. I'll that. read it. Tectone, please read. From uh ccal.45. Is it something weird? No. Oh, okay. It's that's just kind it's just kind of rude. <laughs> it says you're ugly and bald. Cool podcast thumbs up emoji. <laughs> Oh, come on. That's... Why Why did they print this one out? <laughs> There's also some YouTube comments. This one's from Tan Douche. Yeah. I feel like I'm in a parallel universe watching Asmin drink out of a water bottle instead of a 64-ounce Wendy's cup. So I got to talk to y'all about why that is. Well, what happened? Are you on the path to health? If So the longest amount of time that I slept last night was about 41 minutes. Okay. So... Any time that you see me drinking water, I'm down bad. Like I'm either tired, I'm not feeling good, or something is fucked. Yeah. I have to spend an hour driving up here. It's fucking hot. I'm pissed off. The room is hot and I drink the water. 
Because if I drink soda, it's going to take me over the fucking edge. Wait, so so you're fucked up right now? Yeah. That's you've been like the best one I've ever seen here. Maybe I think that you being angry. Normal Seems no, the you, same I, to me. I was me. like, wow, man, I was in a great mood today. <laughs> man, yeah. I'm, I'm fucked up. <laughs> Let me yeah. read the, the other two comments. So Luke dash QZ six EM goaded podcast. I always look forward to this every Friday. Ends the work week perfectly. Thanks for the episode, homies. And we have one from Snow Dragon eighty. Oh. Don't know what's worse. Tectones, pits, or Asmongold socks. Love the podcast. Can't wait for the next one. They do hate your own. What's, what's wrong with socks being gray? I don't know. Because they started white. I think, yeah. I uh, think they're yeah, no. Wait, did they really? It is what it is. Mm -hmm. oh this my. one did. This one's a white sock. You know you can use your underwear. I thought those underwear. were just gray. Well, I mean, what they the were. Fuck? You know, real quick before we end, you, you can, I learned this from Jackie Chan. You can use your, when you go in the shower, just go in the shower in your underwear. Yeah. You can use your underwear as a washcloth and it also washes your underwear. <sighs> And then you just get out and it's all done. You well, did guys, thanks for watching this yep. week. <laughs> <laughs> gamers. Hey, gamers. Thank you so much for watching this epic code. Okay. I can't. Good. <laughs> that was really good. Oh, I, can't, I can't fucking. Thanks, Sir, for coming on the podcast with us this week. It was, it was really great. Yep. Drunk Dude. driving, fucking Pokemon. Like, we got through it all. <laughs> remember, if you want to see Sears balls, make sure to check out our Patreon. Those will be the benefits of our two or three subs and the postcard. It's going to be so epic, gamers. Click on the link down below. Yeah. Patreon.com yeah. slash Steak and Eggs, guys. And this was a really cool epic code. Dude, have you seen me and Sid do a sponsor <laughs> together on stream? No. It is hilarious. We did I a bet sponsor. the sponsors love it. The, they did. We act pseudo yeah. happy. Dude, they were super happy and they approached me for three more. Okay. Yeah, yeah, this, this, we have to talk about this on the, on yeah, the thing. Next episode. Right. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thanks for watching. Peace. <laughs> yeah, Jay's turning on the air conditioner. Yeah. Oh, you know, let's go. Then you turn and you look at me. There's a little glimmer that I can see. A sparkle in your eyes. It makes me realize. I think I discovered a new sandwich option uh, this morning. I spilled the barbecue sauce on my peanut butter and jelly sandwich. That shit was crazy. How do you spill barbecue? How, how do you just have barbecue sauce laying around? Right. So what happened was, is I had a hot dog and yeah. I had a peanut butter and jelly sandwich uh -huh. and I put barbecue sauce on my hot dog because I make, I take my buns and then I air fry them with my hot dog and then I put two cheese strings on the side of it and I heat those up so then I have a cheese dog and then I use the Whataburger spicy ketchup. Oh my God, that sounds so good. And then I use Bubba's barbecue sauce. I don't use Sweet Baby Ray's anymore because I found Bubba's. Bubba's is good as shit. And then it, a little bit dribbled over it. Yeah. And it was fucking good because then it was sweet and it was creamy and it was salty. I am like, I'm fucking Dude, hungry I'm so fuck. hungry. I'm, I'm so on, excited to eat in the meeting. Yeah, I, I'm on the one meal a day meta right now. What, what's your one meal? Uh, usually I'll have like Chipotle or pizza or something like that. And then I'll have like maybe a snack or something else a little bit later on. That's it. Has your Chipotle order changed? Or no, now? why would I change it? Okay, yeah, because you, you changed my life with that. You got me going from black beans to pinto beans and that was the greatest. Because they're better. Yep, they yeah. are. They are better. It's that simple.